So that bull moose just called. Yeah, he was walking over here. Did you see him? I did. I don't want any more. There's a buck though. Oh, nice. Which is really nice. Slightly more what we're after. Yeah, oh, exactly. Yeah, exactly. Hey, there's Zach. What's going on, everybody? Memes. I like it. So, Flinner, you have the inline loaded in slot one, or which one do you have? Yep, slot one. I always yeah. go bow slot two. Yep, me too. Except for the bow's not loaded up. Should probably do that. That might help. Where did our moose go? Uh, do you have the call? Yeah, I didn't want to call anything oh. until we see, like, if we want the buck or the moose. I do see something. Should we call the buck? Yeah, I think so. We'll get to where we can see it in a sec. It should be like, it was right here in the water, right? All right. Uh, let's see, the buck called somewhere over there on this other island, I thought. Yeah, that's what I thought, right about there. And I see nothing but a doe. Yeah, maybe we should put out a grunt. Get some, get his, oh, right there. You see no. the doe? Oh, he's on our side now. How did he get so close? I see the moose, I believe. Yep. Or a moose. Might be a different one. Alright. Yeah. Uh, There's wait, a the... rock here if you want to crawl up this way. Okay. Splinter is the best. I can actually see the chat. So hi. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Flinter is the best, yep. Oh, that buck's walking this way. Oh, you called already, didn't you? No, I haven't called yet. Oh, okay. I guess he's just heading towards us. I'll just stay prone. I think you're in a better... Oh, you are right behind me. I'm trying to get to this rock. It looked like a 150s, 160s. I just saw it. It's walking left to right, the way I'm facing. I can hear it. Yeah. If you want, you can just go for a shot. I'll just get a sick video of it. With the inline or bow? Whichever you want. How close is it? 25 meters. Oh. See oh I see it over there. I just pushed let, you a little bit. Let me put a tracer in quick. Oh, cool. What's the wind like? Uh, You should be fine. That's a good Lower buck. Right at him, but That's a really good yeah. buck. You want to give a call to stop him? Uh, see if I can. I can't see him anymore. I yeah, I don't hear him or anything. Yeah, but he went behind that rock. Do you see that rock by you? The one straight ahead? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, see, I don't know if he's going to smell us. He is directly downwind. Wind always That's blows south good. and north. Yeah. Uh, let's kind of go over here in this direction. Okay. So at least we can see him, because this grass is too tall here. He's just going to pop right up and most likely bust us, and I don't really want that to happen. Mm -hmm. How I mean, can you kill a good whitetail and call the wild, or where? What did the, <laughs> the question's already off the chat. Uh, but I would probably go Chila area is pretty good for whitetail. Norden can be decent. Alright, I don't hear him, so I don't know if he's actually coming in. Yeah, he definitely didn't flee, though. We would have heard that. Hey, Lucas, I'm glad you finally made it to a stream. Okay, now I can hear him. That's the doe behind us, right? But why am I stuck? What am I stuck on? Oh, the yeah. rock? Rock right here. Can we get up this rock? Hey, Chase. Oh, be able perfect. To this perfect. We can get up this rock. Where oh, is I hear them both. The doe. I don't know, but the buck's definitely coming. The doe's right behind you. Yeah. Oh, there's the buck. There's the buck. Here he comes. Yeah. Ready? Yep. 
Better make it's it gonna quick. be about 20 meters away here soon. 160 to 185. Oh, Got any shot? Right behind the tree. You hit him though. So, yeah, I centered him pretty good. But lately I've had this glitch where if you hit too close to the tree, it sticks into the tree. So I'm happy that we didn't mm -hmm. hit the tree. I'm really happy. I'm just watching your angle now. Probably stomach intestine. I'll be happy if we got intestine. There was, it was either that or watch it run away. Yeah, that's the thing because this tree was right here, and I mean, even with the inline, you're not going to really do much. I don't know. Yep. Where the moose went, but that's intestine. Oh, I see the moose out there. You want to give him time and go get this moose? Oh, for sure. Yeah, let's do that. All right. Hey, thank you, Ahmed. Maybe I'll stick a conical in here so that way we're not tracking, hopefully. Yeah, it should give the buck enough time to go lay down. Mm -hmm. What? Well, let's say... it. Well, I mean, it could have been a liver shot, to be honest, but it would have been close. Just like when I look back on your side, it looked uh -huh. like you were behind the liver. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But it's like... Stuff. Where can you get the game at? If you mean this game, if you go on, you can get it on Steam as well as just thehunter.com. Well, Captain, that's because it wasn't exactly smoked. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, it was a solid hit for sure, but I wouldn't call that a smoked hit. That's for sure. <laughs> I don't know if if famous meant to say, "Dad, can you ask Flinter if he did the deer drive?" But I'm gonna call you dad from now on. Just kidding. But uh, oh, okay. What, what, what deer drive? <laughs> oh, hey, Brock. And it looks like Stephen Kirkbridge made it. Good to see you again. So the stream should last for. Well, I don't know. As long as it can, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I got time tonight. Yeah, me too. Oh, there comes a bull. Yeah. That is a pretty cool looking bull. He's got like that the long points kinda, I think if that's the same one anyway. Yeah it is. Do I have an estimate of up to one ninety five on him? Wow. I do. <laughs> I've got one fifty to one seventy five. I have max of one ninety five on him. What's your minimum? One thirty five, I think. Oh, okay. I just put out a call so I could get him to come my way and not stop by you. Where are you at? Right behind okay. you. Oh, I hear him. And oh. there he is. Here he comes. He's coming right to you. Yeah, he's really wide. He's really wide. Yeah, one that's not a bad one. 155 to 190 on him. Okay. Oh, we're on him. So take him when you're ready. <laughs> yep. Oh, this gonna is going to be let a close. Him stop, but guess not. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty awesome. Not going to lie. Could you see that good? I could see it really good. Oh, I'm just watching it now on the stream. <laughs> I really want to know what he's going to score, though. I say 161. Hey. Wow. Not bad. That's, That's one of the... What's that? I was going to say the same thing as you, I think. That's one of those cool, wide racks that score pretty high. Mm -hmm. I was going to say that's probably the highest scoring that rack style that I've had. Yeah, I think the same thing. I haven't seen one that big. I think maybe... <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I think maybe like 140s or 150s. Mm-hmm. Hey, thank you, Spencer. So we could probably track that buck now, right? Yeah, if you got intestines, he's at least laying down, I would say. All right, well, let's go head over there and see if we can't get on the trail. Yeah. Yeah. 
Oh, actually, I see that he said nice shot, Flinter. I thought he said nice shot, DD. <laughs> I guess I said thank you for you. Yes. So that could work too. Thank you for saying thank you. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. I think that's a thing. Wait, hang on. Was he over there? What? Oh, I got. I'm very lost. I. I, I don't know how I'm that on happened. His track. Uh, I thought. I think he was up here, right? Uh. Your marker is where he called. I thought it was where he was down at. We were there. Oh yeah, he came up to this he hill. He was here. Okay. Yeah. That's the tree. I, I recognize that tree. Yeah. The tree that he stopped behind. Yeah. Right behind <laughs> it too. See, I would have taken a shot a little bit quicker, but I thought he was actually going to come in front of the tree. On but our I, side of it. Yeah, I thought he was on our side, so I was kind of being a little more patient. There's yeah. Kyle Moose right there, if you want to take her out. Where at? Right in front of you there, too, right? I still don't see it. Oh. She's right there. Uh, Yeah, I guess I got still... Just because you're all loaded up, yeah. She's pretty broadside, too. Yeah, let's see if I can catch her in the heart. I don't really want to track her, so... Yeah. Oh, she moved. And, of course. <laughs> I'll stop her. There you go. Uh, shot too high for the heart. Ooh. Might have got lungs, though. Oh, you got her hit good? I hope so. I don't know. I was kind of far forward, but... I uh, probably didn't. Never mind. She, <laughs> she tipped over. Just about to say, I probably didn't catch lungs if she made it that far, but... I was going to say, you usually don't miss the vitals too often. <laughs> Guess I was two seconds early. Yep. Hey, Wiggles, good to see you again. Wiggles is alive is right. <laughs> but I can't figure out which way the chat's in yeah, the middle come. again. Why does that happen? Oh, did you not put it there? No. <laughs> yeah, I did catch along. Hey, thank you guys for notifying me, though, and letting me know that. So hopefully the chat's in the right spot now. How's the chat now? Is it still in the right spot? Uh, You might have got it moved a bit, but it doesn't look like it's... Not enough? Oh, now you got it. Now you got it. Okay, good, good. Hey, thank you, little Bass Pro. I really appreciate that. Beautiful. But I don't remember which way this buck ran now. Let's see. I'll come over and help you out. I'm totally lost. Hey, Biggie! Did. I didn't even see him. The chat's just flying by. Yeah. <laughs> We've got uh, 60 people in here almost. Wow. So, did he run this way? I think so. Oh, he did. See, I thought he ran the opposite way of that tree right there. Someone mentioned me passing you in hunting score. I was doing like a ton of duck hunting, trying to get a rare for a lodge and failing, but I think that was when I passed you. It was a while ago, actually. Oh, really? Yeah. We don't have that. So many ducks. I was getting close to passing you with the old uh, hunter score style, and then they changed it, and you were just like 5,000 ahead of me suddenly. <laughs> Let's see, what are we at here? Oh, I can't actually see yours right now. Wait. What, hunter score? Yeah. I'm 34,900 basically, and you're 33,5. Whoa, you are spinning 100 miles an hour on my screen. <laughs> see, that, that's, why, that's why I have to hit the X, because otherwise it happens. Oh, and then it just moves your head to one side, doesn't go any further. <laughs> yeah. I got you. See, I just saw that... Uh, glitch of the tracer out here somewhere. Oh, I forgot you had a tracer. Nice. Yeah. I actually brought some in case we do find something else good. Yeah. It's pretty fun to be able to get something like that with a tracer. Yeah, hunting those buffalo last night with tracers was pretty cool. Yeah, those are pretty cool. Uh, I think he was here and he might have glitched out either that or he was here and then he took off when he took a shot on that moose. 
Are either of these roaming? I think he probably ran into deep water and then turned around for there to be two like that. Oh, okay. Oh, another track going this way. I cannot even keep up with the chat. <laughs> <laughs> Someone mentioned we should uh, do a water bu buffalo hunt sometime soon. Oh yeah, he's for dead sure. Here. For sure. It would be pretty cool, like the old days of hunting bison when they first came out. We were all over them. Oh yeah, definitely. Trying to get them with the recurve. Oh, the buck's down there. <laughs> yeah. I gave him low 170s, this is 7x7. That's not a bad start. Not at all. Considering, oh, it looks like it hit him a little bit too high. But I guess we were up on that rock too, so it wasn't too mm -hmm. bad. Oh. 170s, you're thinking? I think low 170s, high oh. 160s. 169. Yep. <laughs> hit intestine and hip bone on him at 16 meters. Definitely trophy shot worthy. Yeah. <laughs> the antlers are the best part of the deer to eat. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just hold him up so we can see what he looks like. Yeah, I never really got a good look at him. All right, that's good enough. He's pretty wide, actually. Yeah, he's not bad at all. Yeah, I'll go with that for now. Here's the phase of my pheasant hunting with the longbow out of the air or off the ground, because I am not going to hit one out of the air. <laughs> I did it once with a recurve, and it was partially an accident. <laughs> <laughs> I think you were there for that. Oh, got another buck. Yeah, perfect. Right up here, too. You think we can call you it? Uh, yeah. I feel like I see him. Yep, definitely see him. Uh, it's a 110 yeah. buck or something like that. Nothing crazy. No. But if he stopped out there, it would be pretty cool to take a nice shot on him. Yeah. With the inline. Let's see. No, I don't Antelope see him and call the wild would be sick. What was I that? Think someone mentioned having an antelope map in Call of the Wild. I think that'd be awesome. Oh yeah, for sure. I'd love them in this game, but the graphics in Call of the Wild would be so nice. That's a monster. 189 Blacktail. Congratulations, Carson. Yeah, that's awesome. Pretty rare. Indeed. Um, I don't know if he's going to stop or not. At some point he should. It's not the greatest angle. But if he stops, he can definitely make it work. Yeah, the angle he's at, you could put it probably through his neck and still get lungs if you miss the neck bone. You want to give a grunt and see if he'll stop? Try it. Probably not, huh? I guess not. The one, the one time you actually want an animal to stop when it's walking in from distance and it doesn't. Uh oh, he put his head down. <laughs> Whoops. Oh no, Tell I dropped him. <laughs> I thought I was gonna hit skull and then it was gonna be body. Just watching this now. Oh, I see. Yeah. <laughs> I wonder if it was brain. It must have been brain. It might have been. Or straight heart. Could have been that too. A 28 melanistic pheasant? That's huge. Uh, wow. <laughs> yeah, that'd be pretty awesome to see.
How big was your albino pheasant? Uh, like 22 or something like that. Yeah. 20, 21 or 22. That was our hump filled with rares. Got head, shoulder blade, and right lung on him. Yeah, not bad. So I don't know how it went through the skull into the shoulder blade, but at least it did. Won't complain about mm -hmm. that. Yeah. We're on that bear island now. Yeah, it's not really typically full of white hills, but... So we got a doe here. Maybe we should go somewhere wanna, else, huh? I was just going to say that. What were you thinking? Uh, we could either go to the lodge or maybe this tent had like that general direction. That's the ugliest arrow I've ever drew. Drew? Drawn? <laughs> well, it looks like you want to cut across the river, then go across that island, and then come over to this other kind of peninsula area. Well, kind of. just meant that general direction, but yeah. Well, I was sort of wondering if you wanted to hunt... Um, I don't know if you remember, we used to have a bear bait somewhere between here and the tree stand. Uh, can't really see where to draw right now. I think that might be it. No, I can't hit it. No. But anyways, like, there's an island right out there with the exclamation point by it. Do you see it? Uh, like, just to the right? Yeah. Like, somewhere in between here and that exclamation point. And I know there's a lot of white tails in this swamp area. I don't know if you want to hunt that swamp area for some bucks. Yeah, we can try that. So basically backtrack the way we came, but then go out the other way. Mm -hmm. Oh, Wiggle says swamp is better. Somebody said that I should start a live stream. My internet's too slow. I can't start a live stream, unfortunately. Yeah. I'd love to. I can just barely upload a video and watch a different YouTube video in like 144p if I'm lucky. <laughs> How old is Flinter? Flinter is 20. Proud of it. <laughs> Proud of it. Yeah. Hey, Kyle. Use the 10 gauge lever action. That was one of my choices for tonight, actually, before we decided on kind of like the inline and the 6.5. I feel like the 10 gauge is a really, really all around good gun for the Hunter mm -hmm. Classic. Yeah. What did I just use that for? Oh, we were doing some uh, drives on the new map last night, and I was shooting Sandbar and Feral Hog with it. Oh, that would work good for that. Yeah, I got a 1090 Hog and a 202 Rusa. Now, do they score like Red Deer, sort of, the same um, principle? Uh, like... Number-wise. How they're scored? Or, uh, no, not, not how they're scored. I guess... Uh, like, a big red deer gets up to, like, 270s. Do, do they get that big mm -hmm. or no? Uh, I think 245 was tops on the leaderboard, so I'm guessing they could get 250, 260 mm -hmm. maybe. So that sounds like a roe deer almost. Yeah. And then Sandbar, I think we're up in the 350s or close to it. Oh, really? Yeah. Captain, he's done uh, one or two of them already, I think. Yeah. I keep getting asked to do face reveals and I've actually had one on the channel before. Yeah, so it wouldn't really be a review. <laughs> a face reshow. <laughs> a reshow. It has been over a year since I've had my face in a video, but... Oh. Well, <laughs> maybe they forget. Yeah, I need to get an actual decent camera at some point. Get your game on. Hey, Rods and Reels, I don't really know what that means. Get your game on. Maybe I think that was to... part of a song. Oh, okay. <laughs> I thought I saw the lyrics going by. 
Yeah, I saw that with uh, Zach, I think he was doing. Yeah, it was Zach. Yeah. Did somebody say they got an albino non-tip? Because that is pretty awesome if someone did. I thought I saw that come up somewhere. I can't, like, every time I look over, it just buzzes by. <laughs> Yeah, usually when I get ready to answer a question, the chat like, yeah. disappears, so I have to try and remember what my last thought was. Yep. Try to remember what the question was and what you were about to say. Exactly. You are an albino non-tip? Well, not fear you, but you better watch out. <laughs> an albino cloud. Hey, the Hunter Ed NDS and also Cody Edwards. Got a commoose. He's Sergeant Wrecker as well. Sergeant Wrecker. Yeah, I see her. Uh, oh, I thought she just laid down, but I think she just walked down a hill. Oh, there's a bull running over there is what I saw. A tiny oh, there's bull. a bull? Yeah, he's pretty small. I could try to, like, take him through the spine at 180 meters, but I don't really think that's a good idea. Yeah, I wouldn't recognize, or recommend that. Wouldn't recognize it either. <laughs> yeah, not doing that. A good way to get a body shot, Moose. <laughs> and then waste a ton of time tracking them. Not even 100 scoring Moose. I have an albino elk with a pink rack in my trophy lodge. How did that happen? He didn't have a pink rack when I put him there. Wait, who's that? Uh, somebody said that I have an albino elk with a pink rack. It's a tiny one, like 113 score, but it had, didn't oh, have a Oh, you do have an rack. albino, huh? I do, yeah. It was the dumbest way to kill one. Oh, okay. I'll get. I'll make it a short story. I was, I was actually already recording because I just got my new uh, CPU fan. So I was just hunting Whiteheart and like testing, like recording, putting the CPU under some strain and seeing how the temperature was. Never even called for elk. Was turkey hunting actually for a competition, and I hear footsteps and turn around and there's just an albino bull walking under my tower. How cool is that? <laughs> got it at like. 12 meters probably. Those albinos look so cool. Hmm. There's that cow. I don't really want to take her with a gun now that we're into the area that we haven't really spooked everything in. Yeah, exactly. We're just getting into the good area here. Yeah. I think it rains on it could be in too much wiggles. Yeah, a lot of thunderstorms going on there lately. I am 27. You know, it always seems like you're way more than seven years older than me every time I talk to you. Well, it <laughs> seems like you're the same age as me every time I talk to you. Oh, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> when is my next video? My next video is in approximately... Wow. Did you see that? There's a moose running to our left. I just heard something take off. Not a bad one. 140s. Maybe 150. Oh, way over there. Now I see it. I don't know where he was standing. Anyway, my next video is in like 17 hours or something like that. 5 Eastern tomorrow. Oh, wow. Check got out another this... person asking how old I am, too. Oh, really? Check out this <laughs> oh, door right here glitched on this rock. <laughs> here. Oh, she's gone. <laughs> You mentioned her, and she heard it. Dee looks 24, Flinter looks 17. I know I look 17. <laughs> and apparently I sound 30 from what people tell me. You got noticed by a deep... Interesting. You got one of the shirts, or how did that happen? I'm yeah, intrigued. I don't, I don't know that part. 
What state am I in? I'm in Pennsylvania, which has terrible internet, apparently. <laughs> apparently. Uh, well, apparently everywhere that's not here has just fine internet, but... Oh, there's spotty areas. Yeah. I'll take the being able to hunt 300 yards from the house. Can't beat that. This must be that bull track right there. Yeah, I wanted to see if I could him and maybe just get him with a bow. Oh, really? Yeah, I don't necessarily want to shoot a gun for the same reason, but... Yeah, I was kind of thinking we're getting to a pretty good area for whitetails here. Mm-hmm. Someone was asking what our personal best moose is. Yours and mine, or just yours, or...? Uh, both of ours, I think. Oh, okay. I don't know what yours is. 229 here on Red Feather. Oh, wow. Oh, what the heck? I spooked that same doe again. <laughs> that moose is down here against the deep water, so I guess I'll try to get him. Okay. Do I hunt in real life? Yeah, I, uh... I do, and somebody also asked what I use. Bow or 30-30, mostly. Wait, is this the same moose that you see right now? Uh, nope. Because I see not one even looking right the same in front direction. of me. I was wondering, yep. like, <laughs> I don't understand. Yeah. There's one right in front of me, too. Oh, no, this one's not even 110 max on them. Yeah, it's a small one. <laughs> Winter, can you fly? Um, no. I could <laughs> probably get in an airplane, but I've never done that even. Thirty, th <laughs> thirty, thirty, bold action. I never even heard of that. Flinternet is right, Biggie. Flinternet. Wait, didn't you just go to bed not that long ago? I was just talking to you. I just realized that. <laughs> <laughs> maybe it wasn't. Maybe it was longer ago than I thought. Time to wake up. Yeah, I guess. It was like when I got back from taking my sister home. It wasn't that long ago. I'm gonna whack this moose and hopefully not track it. Yeah. Oh wait, I just called an accident. I forgot that. It's dead. Oh okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> What's my personal best real life whitetail? It's a nine point with a like seventeen and a half inch spread. It's not too bad. I don't actually know what it scored. I know you've got some pretty good ones with the bow, haven't you? Uh, only one, I mean, really, really big one, but a few 130s and 140s. Mm -hmm. But yeah, my 13 point with the bow is the biggest one. Yeah, my, uh, what? Do you see this bull? Yeah, I'm watching him. Okay. Wow, that is a giant, isn't it? Yeah, it is. His eyes are glitching out of his head for me, too. Looks weird. Got a pretty good wing. Uh, don't worry, I don't think his, uh, sense of smell has developed yet. <laughs> he just turned around. What the heck? Yeah. Where is he going? Two ninety three buck in Illinois. Is that a non typical apparently. Let's see. Sixty six. Let's see what I happens. I see this. <laughs> oh no. Nope. Anytime I ever try to take a long shot, they start walking before I shoot. Yeah. Is Canada a good place to hunt? I have no idea. I've never been there, but it sure seems like it from what I hear. <sighs> nice shot. Got him. Thank you. I like, wasn't even paying attention that I heard your arrow. <laughs> he was kind of walking, put a little lead on him, and pulled the trigger. 
Man, everybody's asking me questions. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite thing to hunt in real life and in game. Well, whitetail is pretty much the only thing I hunt in real life. I have to say in game whitetail as well. Can DD fly? <laughs> uh, nope. I can't. Man, one of these the hunter YouTubers can fly, I'm sure. Probably. Maybe Zaggy. Straight heart shot. Nice. One on one. Someone's asking about earning EM. Really, if I'm completely honest, that's not a great option. I've done it. It's just slow and annoying and time wasting. Yeah, I'd have to agree with you there. If you're gonna do it, do the ones where you're downloading apps because a lot of the other stuff can give viruses and just it's not really worth the risk. Then you have to I clean out be... your computer again. Mm-hmm. I would be doing competitions where, quite honestly, like working, do a mow somebody's grass for five bucks and then buy them because it's just it'll be less time consuming to do that than to earn five hundred EM. For sure. But it does work. It's just yep. really, really time consuming, and then you get stressed out because you have to. Well, your computer won't work as good. Yeah. I must have done like 50 surveys and only got accepted for one of them because you do like the whole survey and then they decide if you qualify for the last like three questions that actually matter. If you don't qualify, you're not getting DM, so you, I, those are not worth it either. Yeah, for sure. Hey, Lily. Of course we noticed you. Ten gauge. Are you hearing that? Flinter. Am I hearing what? Did you hear the like little noise that pops up when someone subscribes? I've got the uh, the stream muted, so I'm not hearing myself and you twice. Oh, okay, cool. I saw the uh, icon though. Maybe we can uh, switch to the 10 gauge for loggers if people want it that bad. Yeah, for sure. Someone just asked me to say happy belated birthday to them, which I'm cool with, but if your birthday's in two days, that doesn't quite make sense to me. Bear, 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 bear. Really? Okay. Belated birthday is after, if you don't know that. He's fair game. <laughs> yeah, cool. <laughs> Didn't know you were going to do that. <laughs> I don't even know where it is. Definitely got a couple in them. I finally just got eyes on it after you shot ten times. <laughs> <laughs> yep, empty to clip out. It was kind of like a chocolate or a cinnamon colored one. I think it was cinnamon or blonde, I did see it. Chicago Benson, you have been noticed. <laughs> <laughs> what is your personal best deer in the game, both of you? What is your Here? splinter? White tail. Uh, white tail is that 199 that I got in your loggers open hunt. 199.2 or something. With a bow? Uh, yeah, I got it with the recurve. Terrible shot, but I got it. <laughs> wow. I sort of remember that, but not really. Remember, I thought it was 170, and then we were both just completely shocked. Oh yeah, now I remember. <laughs> Oh, there's some blood here. Yeah. Got him at least one out of the ten shots. I know you got me beat in the white tail. Actually, white tail and mule deer. You got me beat by a little bit. Barely. The white tail, I barely have you beat. I remember that uh, one. There, I wasn't... Goes, there goes the bear. Here comes the bear. Oh. Gonna get the 50 treatment if it ain't dead. Get it. That's a big bear. 21 to 24. Nice shot. Thank you. Good stuff. Yeah, my biggest white tail is 200.3. So, I mean, 199 is not very far off from that. Yeah. That was the day the servers were screwed up, right? Nobody could join your game? Yeah, that was the day that the trophy shots were all messed up, too. So there was no trophy shot. Huh. But luckily I screenshotted it. Mm -hmm. so I this... definitely remember your mule deer though, that was amazing. Oh yeah, this is a big bear, right? 
That should be 22, I think, from the weight estimate. 235.8 kgs. Uh, maybe 21. 22.1, and I think this is a chocolate or cinnamon? Uh, chocolate is darker than that, I believe. One, Could two, be cinnamon. three, four, five hits on them. <laughs> and actually got intestine and right hind leg, it looks like. So, pretty nice bear. Yeah. Really nice. Got almost 80 people in here. No wonder I can't keep up with the chat. That's crazy. <laughs> oh, that's pretty awesome right there, actually. That looks really Did cool. I move? No, <laughs> stay right there. Okay. Whoa, I don't know what just happened, but that's the craziest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> what? What the heck? I just I took a picture and like, yeah, you have to see what just happened. Oh, it does look cool. Waiting. But did you see what happened? What? What? The... Where the deer like popped up? I have never seen that. What? I wonder. That's... I have never seen that. That's like the uh, thumbnail to the muzzleloader hunting video that I did. I sort oh, of, is that what that was? Yeah, I sort of like vaguely remember that picture. <laughs> Alright, so if we go north anymore, we're going to get to more bear and maybe blacktails? Yeah. So should we go like kind of east, you think? Yeah, we should be running into even elk if we do that, so that'd be kind of cool. Alright, let's do that. Yeah, that was a big... I don't know if that was chocolate or cinnamon or what it was, but... Yeah. Even the blondes are almost that color, so it's hard to say. True. Yeah, that was definitely a glitch, Wiggles. Definitely say that again. Because it was weird. I went to take a picture, and all of a sudden that popped up. <laughs> I was like, this is not the bear that we just got. Another bear. I don't have an Instagram, do you? Uh, I've recently being asked. I recently <laughs> got one. Nice. Two seventy-eight point five. That's a monster red deer. Actually, the biggest one I ever got was two seventy-four, but that was probably almost two years ago. I haven't even got one past two fifties lately. I can't break two fifties for some reason. <laughs> two forty-seven. I have two two forty-seven. Stags, and that's the best I can get. I don't know if my personal best is high 277 or low 278, but I've always had fair luck with red deer if I really try. Well, I tried really hard, and I got a 247. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and you had a couple, two or three, uh, specifically hunting red deer, right? For your uh, lodge? Yeah, but I had more videos where I recorded them but I never even uploaded them because it just nothing happened mm -hmm. I've had those pretty much Zach that's pretty much right on the head I didn't even know the got so far were the lyrics of that I can never figure out what he said there <laughs> yeah it's hard to understand them how many kills have you gotten with the recurve which one I've got three I have to combine them all. I, I gotta do quick maps in my head. Wait, three I've, recurs? Uh, the classic carbon and heavy. Bull. I just heard a bear moaning. Bull right here. Oh, cool. Even better. Tiny. Yeah. Tiny bull. Spectacularly small. 80 to 105. Oh, there's the bear. There's the bear. Yep. She's running over there. You wanna there's take another. her with the conical? I can try. I can, yeah, this should work. Watch me miss with my one shot that I have. Oh, I almost did when it ran against that tree. <laughs> Alright. Oh, she's going to stop. There you go. Yeah, good, because there's grass in my way. <laughs> See if I can catch the spine, maybe. Or... Did Whoa. I get it? <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. Oh, sorry. 
I don't think I hit the spine. Oh, you're going for spine? I tried to go spine, and then if not, I should have gotten maybe back of the lung or intestines for sure. Alright. Well, she's kind of going in a pretty decent direction. Yeah, she's running kind of where we wanted to go anyway. So I guess we could catch up. What do you think we should do roughly an hour or maybe a little more on Red Feather before we switch? Yeah, something like that. Okay. That was a 26 pointer. That's the one that was in. Oh boy, Illinois or Iowa, whatever the heck. Can't remember. That's a lot of points. Yeah, I did catch intestines here. Oh, nice. Yeah, I think at some point I'm going to get merch. I've been working on designing it, and it didn't look quite what I was hoping when I uh, actually got it on stuff, so I'm probably going to end up uh, switching which site I use. i got to get back to working on that. I don't even see who you're answering. Oh, okay, I see it now. Yeah, <laughs> it just like... goes so fast. <laughs> I was like, where did you get that from? <laughs> just thought I'd plug my merch that's coming out at some point. Nice. I sort of thought it was uh, Chicago Benson because I know he said it a few times too. Yeah, I saw it go by fast earlier and forgot about it. Yeah. Violated the law. Yeah, I probably did. Uh, is that... That's a branch. I don't think we should shoot that. This bear is going a long ways. Yeah, I might slow down a little bit. Keep jumping him up. I think I limited 2010. I might have. All right, have a good I can't night. Can't remember. Yeah, I've played it. Or 2011, I think. I mean, there's a few different years. Mm -hmm. Basically, the exact same game. Just. I was, yeah, I was years. gonna say. I definitely played several from the Hunting Unlimited series. I got a bull moose up there. Yeah, it's the same track from before, but I don't know if it was a decent one or not. I haven't had any tracks over like maybe 520 max. True. Yeah, I remember Hunting yeah. Unlimited where it made the turkeys look like birds. It didn't even look like turkeys. I don't even remember turkeys in the game I was playing. I might have had an older one then. Oh, wow. I just gave that moose a call in case it's a rare or something crazy. You can see really good here, actually. This is not a bad area. No underbrush. Yeah. Well, I have a stand not too far away from here. Are we by... Yeah, we are. That little lake over there that there's all this black tail. My bear's yeah. down here. Oh, there he is. Hiding behind a stump. Great intestine. I just heard that sound effect. <laughs> like the bison, the bison sound effect that they used to have. Yep. For some reason that one didn't, but like nine times out of ten I jump when that happens. Oh. Wait, do we have the out caller? Yeah, we do. Okay, good. Try well, DBH for your merch? What the heck is DBH? Never <laughs> even heard of that. Good question. Oh, bear, bear, bear. I was taking a drink, so that took me a while to stop. <laughs> Looks like a decent one, too. I don't even see it. No, it's a female. Ah. I wouldn't mind taking a poke at her, though. Mm hmm. Except for I have to switch out ammunition. Yeah. Uh, there's a moose behind her. Oh, nice. It's probably smaller than average bull. Maybe average. That bear looks like she stopped. 
Uh, yeah, Rudolph's in the game this year. Rudolph the Dead Nosed Reindeer. Uh huh. Not Bad funny. Bad yeah, I'd, I wouldn't take that. Uh, that. That's exactly what I just did, and it didn't work out. I'm gonna get on this moose if you want to try to double though. Where's the bull? Just there to the right. That's not a bad bull. <laughs> yeah, I'd give him like low 130s, mid 130s maybe. Are you ready on that moose? Yep. I'm almost ready on this bear. Oh, please don't stop there. Of course. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, I'm not ready either. Okay. Actually Dude. gonna walk a little bit. Are you ready? Uh, yeah. He's moving anyway. Ready whenever. Alright, I'm ready. Yep. Ready? Counter down. Oh, come on, it turned away. <laughs> this guy is not cooperating. Alright, I'm ready. Are you ready? Yep. Alright, one, two, three, shoot. Oh, that looked really good. That looked good and it felt good. Mine was not. If I'm lucky, I got him testing. He, uh, like, stepped upwards on the tree. <laughs> It was my fault. I said one, two, three, shoot. <laughs> it was a little bit too fast. A 290 red deer? I might have to doubt that just a tiny bit. Just a bit. Do you have blood? Uh, did I run past it? I thought he was up here further. I think he was... I don't know. I didn't see how close he was actually to you. Oh, okay. Yeah, he was here. Uh, yep, I caught intestines, luckily. Hey, look at that. I got intestine too. <laughs> or that's... Yep, intestine. That almost had to be liver, though. I thought I was too high for that. Track going back this way. I don't see any of his tracks on my end. Yeah, it ran this way. Did it? Yeah, I never even saw it cut back this way. <laughs> I didn't either. But okay. Some pretty decent blood. I just, I only got intestine. I can tell by how much bleeding there is. Are you going to give him a little bit of time, or...? Oh, he already started roaming here. I should have. <laughs> <laughs> you would have found him already. Yeah. Though he might not have run off, because they're moose, but... Yeah, they usually go, what, like 50, 60 meters and kind of stop trotting a little bit. Mm hmm I don't see him, so if he's here, he's hiding really well. All right, welcome back, Parker. I don't see this bear track here. Uh, this moose did run off again. The bad thing is, if either of us, or both of us, rather need a follow-up shot, we're going to spook the other one's animal, I think. Uh, I see my bear bedded down here. Oh, nice. Do the new bear models get back up when their intestine hit if you, like, run up to them? I wouldn't test it. Yeah, I know the old ones used to, but like the new bear models, they like freeze when they lay down. I've never seen them even so much as like turn and look at you. Oh, really? Or me. Yeah. Oh, well, let's see what happens. You gonna try? Oh, I'll just walk towards them and see what happens. 10 mil in hand, maybe? That's not a bad idea. She's down. Nice. How many South Americans does it take to change a light bulb? I don't know. I have a feeling this probably isn't going to end well, though. <laughs> intestine. Just straight intestine? Straight intestine. Yeah, that's definitely... That's what I got on the last bear, and that's definitely what I got on this moose. But I feel like moose take a little bit longer to go down with just intestine. Yep. 
For sure. You heard that cow there? Yeah. That means the bull probably is between me and her. Because, oh, well, I guess it could be. Oh, I see the cow. Oh, yep, there's the bull. Hanging his head. Finish He's him not off. happy. Yeah, I think. Well, I hope I can catch along there. I'm shooting between trees. And he starts walking. Oh, boy. Theme of the day so far. If I can get a good shot, I'll take it, too. Okay. But I don't see him. Yeah, I actually don't even see him now. Uh, where did he go? What? Interesting. <laughs> did he spook? I... Oh, there he is. Alright. Stop walking, dude. He, he walks two steps and he gets perfectly behind a tree every time. <laughs> Alright. That's gonna be in the lungs anyway. He's not gonna go too much further. Oh, I see him. Get him? I don't know. I just put one in him, I think. Okay. Is my, uh... Uh, whoops. I think I just shot the cow. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that's not good. Yeah, the bull's down. When my uh, muzzleloader is firing, are you hearing the whole sound play out? Oh yeah, I heard it pretty good. Okay, yours cut off there. I was just wondering if that's a bug or maybe it was just your distance. Oh, I, from I pulled it off really quick, like so I could see without mm. the scope. Yeah, that's probably what did it. Sometimes I just let the whole animation kick in, so I could see the yeah. smoke and everything. But sometimes mm. I just pull the scope off quick. Yeah. So you didn't even shoot at this guy, apparently? No, I think I shot at the cow on accident. <laughs> I got right lung on that second shot. Oh, nice. She doesn't look hurt, just... so maybe I missed her, hopefully. I think she was right about here. I got a track here. Yeah. When I was new to the game, for some reason, I just thought this little lake would have been the best spot ever for moose. I think I probably saw one here and just assumed they were always here, but... Oh, yeah, I remember getting some moose out here, like, my first 150s bull. Yeah, I want to say my my first decent bull was here. Yeah. Let's see, uh... I actually don't see blood. You might have missed. Well, that's a good thing. It's actually a good thing, yeah. <laughs> I'm happy about that. Hey, Parker, well, that happens sometimes. Splinter is the best, wants to know if we're going to do a public game or drive later. I don't know. It's a pretty good spot for Blacktail here too. Yeah, I'm surprised we haven't had a, a call or a track really. Well, don't ask me about shed horn or I mean shed antlers. I always call them shed horns. Oh, I say I I always get the word wrong. Oh, you do? Yeah, now I'm calling <laughs> buffalo. I'm saying they have antlers. <laughs> I, I think I see that moose. Well, she just Oh, I thought she just laid down. She just walked up a tree kind of. Yeah, no, there's no blood, so I don't think she was even hit. Yeah, it should be fine. I was going to say something. Oh, there was a, a rusa or a sandbar. I can't tell the difference. There was a shed on the porch of the lodge. I just went to <laughs> put a different buffalo that I shot in there. No I couldn't way. even pick it up, but yeah, it was kind of cool. That is pretty cool. How many 200 plus buffalo do you have now? Three? Nice. I know you got, what was that, a 237? Yeah, that's pretty big. Yeah, I had 234, 228, and 202, I think, are my three. Oh, so you're on leaderboards. Yep, and then in that hunt that we did last night, I didn't put it in the video because it may or may not be in a future video, but my friend shot a 235, I think. Really? Yeah. Wow. He may or may not have also shot it five times. 
<laughs> five times. Yeah. Wow. I might make like a, a silly video out of that. If yeah. I get the chance. Yeah. You know what's funny? The one that I actually got. Um, when I walked up to him, I saw an arrow sticking out of his shoulder blade. What? What? Somebody hit him in the shoulder blade first. Oh, really? Yeah. I thought it was the glitch that you were talking about. He was actually hit? Yeah, he was actually hit. Crazy. Hey, there's a buck. Yeah, we got a black toe calling. Actually, was that the same one or a different one? Same one, I think. So basically, whoever took a shot at that with a camel pulser or whatever pulser it was, they just barely missed a giant water buffalo by like two inches. They hit him a little bit too high in the shoulder blade. Yeah. So that was a little bit unfortunate for them. Yeah, and they don't care if you shoot them in the body. They'll just keep on going. They don't even hang their head. Even with three arrows in the body, they still just keep on going. Did you determine that one? Yeah, I did. <laughs> I shot one with the 340. I rushed my shot and it was low in the chest. And uh, I had that body shot. He just could not have cared less. Oh, really? Yep. Did you call? No, I didn't. I was about to. Oh. Okay, cool. Bear just took off, I think. Or is it. Uh, nope, in? walking at us. Oh. Another tiny one. Well, we might have to try and take him out or her out with a bow. So we don't spook the blacktail too much. Yeah. There's something walking to our right as well. Like in front of us to our right, kind of. See, there's a nice rock right here. If we could get up that rock, I think we'll be in a good position. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that bear's easy in range, but I don't like shooting them walking. You did no. stop there. 26 meters. If you can get him, go for it. Yeah, sure. About a 50% chance that it spooks. Alright, here we go. I don't even remember. There. Perfect. <laughs> right for in the front shoulder. There. Yeah, I couldn't remember which pin to use. <laughs> I haven't shot the pulser. For so long. It really is a great bow. Oh, it is for sure, yeah. Another bear. I thought I heard more bear sounds. Can we get up this rock? Perfect. That one's spooked, apparently. So the blacktail should be coming in now. Yeah, I don't think that would have spooked them. No. Hey. There he is. Yep. Is that a different one or the same one? I had rediscovered on that one. I thought I was still on the other buck, but if that's the case, I picked up his track at some point, so I don't know. Well, I heard a buck call before, but I don't think we, I picked up another track since that buck called, and this one just said rediscovered. Yeah, that's what I just had. Like, exact same thing. So unless, though I can see horn, or I can see the the antlers coming up. It's a one twenties black tail. Little guy. Yep. I just realized I still have the fifties loaded, so I'm not shooting anything small with that. <laughs> oh yeah, me too. But where's this bear? See if you can't see this bear. Uh, kept on hearing it walking, so it's not that far away, but. Behind a tree or something, it looks like. Oh, yeah. Oh, I see the tiny buck out there. I'd give him one. Yeah, he's 120, probably. But is he by himself? Oh, there's a bear. There's a bear. Right there to yep. the right, like maybe 50, 60 meters out. I'm going to go with the 45 on this buck. And you can okay. take out the bear. Try. I don't even see it. Do you see, like, that rock right there kind of to your right? Uh, yeah. He's going to be coming right to that rock here any second now. Oh, I see it. What do we got? It's a female. Oh, what the heck? What? I'm on her if you can see the buck. She stopped perfectly. Oh, okay. Where is the buck? 
Uh, I can just barely see the buck. Okay, are you okay. ready? Yep. All right, one, two, three, shoot. I was waiting for you. Oh, sorry. I was waiting for you. <laughs> Did you get a I good hit? I didn't know. If, I think I forgot bears like take off like they're shot out of a cannon as soon as they get spooked, so I'm not sure. Oh. I should bear, have. Your bear is down. Is it? Yep. Wait. Nice shot. Thanks. I see you dropped the buck as well. Oh yeah, he dropped too pretty fast. Oh yeah, I must have caught one lung or something. Probably. I forgot the bears can like walk backwards, so she would stop perfectly for a while and then she walked backwards and almost had her vitals hidden. Yeah, I thought this one kind of looked non-typical at first, but it wasn't. Yeah, it's got like an awkwardly tall rack for yep. a black toe. 116, heart shot. Nice. It was only on 40 meters out though, but... Hey, heart shot's a heart shot. Yeah. 13 bear. We are... And in the middle of the map. Do you want to keep heading east? Maybe get into elk territory? I just had an elk track somewhere. Yeah. I heard a female call. Actually, I did have a bull track as well. Yeah, let's head east a little bit here. Okay. See, I have a B right back option. I can just hit that. Ah, fancy. Take a drink. All right, now we're back. Yeah, what do you think of that camel thirty odd six? I think I wanted it really bad. What what event was that for? It was a. It was the top prize for something. Was it the summer fiesta? Sounds about right. Yeah, I wanted it so bad, but I couldn't get a 190s blacktail, so I had to just bow out of that competition. But it, when that's viable, I'm definitely getting it because it looks so good. Oh, so you can't get it right now? No, it'll be it'll be viable at some point. Oh. Yeah, I'm yeah, looking forward to that. I sort of saw it in the store, but I guess I didn't really notice if it was viable or not. But it looked pretty cool. Yeah, I think maybe a couple of someones that are live streaming should do a drives video with that when it comes out. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> maybe do a, a couple of hunts first to get slightly better weapon skills so we're not swaying, but... Yeah, exactly. That would be a lot of fun. Well, because a lot of times when you're taking these running shots, you have to either be standing or crouched. Yeah. And, I mean, even if you're crouched, it's like, by that time, you're not going to get a decent shot off. So you want to just take, like, a running, standing shot most of the time, and you'll be swaying like crazy with a new gun. Yep. One thing we could do is, uh, get towers, I guess. Yeah, that works really good, too. To be, like, posted, posted up in a tower or tripod. Yeah. You still have your Whiteheart drive set up with like the towers and stuff? It's been so long since I've done that. Oh yeah, it's definitely set up. We might have to try <laughs> that out. Yeah. The Summer Fiesta ended a good few months ago, so I imagine that gun should be any time now. Yeah. I don't see any tracks right now. Nope, I got nothing here. That's one thing about Call of the Wild, you almost always have tracks somewhere. Yeah, that's true. I keep seeing people uh, asking about Call of the Wild and stuff. It's in my mind now. Oh, asking about like when a certain map's going to come out and stuff? Uh, pretty much every question you could ask about it. Oh, really? 
Every now and then I see it and then I think, yeah, I'll get to that, and it's gone and I forget. <laughs> Might have a buck with that doe that just called. Oh, that's did, a good question. Did you hear it? Uh, Blacktail? Yeah. I didn't hear the buck. It, no, I said there might be a buck with the doe. Oh, yeah, because the blacktail are like that sometimes. Mm -hmm. Sort of like cow elk sometimes, too. Yep. I haven't seen that. The herd of like five elk and a bull. Five cows and a bull, I meant. <laughs> yeah. What is your opinion on the new map? In Call of the Wild? Uh, or this game? I'm thinking it's the water buffalo map. Yeah, that would make more sense. It's a bit more new. Yeah. You want to go first on that one? Oh, no, I asked you the question. Oh, I thought it was someone asking that. Um, well, they asked that, but I was asking you, so then you uh, can answer first. Gotcha. Well, uh, the, the big animals, the buffalo and the bantang You're are right. pretty cool. Like, Buck. Very unique. Yeah. Just heard that. I like the water buffalo are so much fun to hunt, but the, I'm I'm glad the bantang aren't uh, just letting you run up to them like the water buffalo and bison and stuff. <laughs> that looked like a decent buck, and that cut me off. <laughs> <laughs> I saw him for half a second, but um, I don't know. We need either the ability to call in sandbar deer or another species. I think because. Feral hog to me are boring, and the only other animal we can actually call are the uh, rusa deer. That is not a big buck at all. I don't know what I was looking at. I Definitely didn't see needed a heart attack. <laughs> <laughs> no warning whatsoever. <laughs> well, you were watching him, weren't you? Uh, I was. I think I put my spotting scope down. I don't even know anymore. Oh, you weren't <laughs> still watching them, monka. Okay. I thought you wanted to see it from your point of view. Yeah, it definitely wasn't anything special anyway. No, it wasn't. Wait a minute. He didn't even shoot the one I was looking at. and that, Either that or he ran a little bit. What? I mean, I just saw a tiny one. Is that what you shot, a little one? Yeah. Okay, he did run, yeah. Oh, okay, yeah. All the confusion. So, but here's my question. What do you think of the uh, scenery of the map? The scenery? Mm -hmm. Um, like, quite honestly, I think graphically it's actually a, a downgrade a little bit from Timbergold, but, like, everything looks nice. The beaches are really cool and stuff, but, like, the trees and stuff actually look slightly less detailed, in my opinion, but maybe it's just, like, okay. the the type of vegetation that they're going for because I don't I don't know what it should actually look like but to me it actually does seem just a bit more cartoony maybe very good point what did you think of the the map when you first saw it well when I first found out about the new map coming out I wasn't very well I wasn't really looking forward to it that much mm -hmm. until I found that there was going to be some water buffalo. Exactly. And that kind of turned me a little bit more towards it. And the fact that they are pretty easy to get close to, mm -hmm. it was fun right away, but I feel like I don't know if it's going to be enough of a challenge. Yeah, I'm afraid we're going to get the bison effect, which is yeah. run up to it, shoot it, get, get to the next one, which is fun for a while, and it's a good running gun thing, but it's not a blast for me, which is why I think we need something else we can call in to balance that out. Yep. Because white rhyme's the same problem. Like, there's moose that you can call in, and if you're in the bison area, that's really the only other thing you're going to see. Uh -huh. Like, arctic fox and stuff aren't down there, so it's just like you're hunting a couple of species with, with, and you just run up to them and shoot them. You don't call them in. There's not much of a challenge, but... I mean, you can see them a mile away, too, because the thing weighs yep. a thousand pounds. <laughs> at least they're a little better at hiding than the bison are. Yeah, no, they're not out in the wide open white, and they stand out a mile away. But they're basically like school buses driving around out in the swamp, and <laughs> <laughs> you just have to see one. 
Yeah, and they got gigantic handlebars, if it's the big ones. You ought to see that from render distance. Oh, yeah, I know. It, look, it just looks so cool to see that thing running, like, right out of render distance, and you fire a couple mm -hmm. of shots, and you're like, oh, that was big. Did you uh, look at how they're scored? Oh, uh, no. I don't quite understand that, and maybe bison are actually the same, which might be why they're so hard to judge, but it's the circumference what? like at the base and then three different points going up the horn and then all added together minus the deductions for each uh, section. Like, oh, really? From what I can tell, the length of the horn makes absolutely zero difference. Because that's my, hard my, to believe. Yeah. And my friends, it, it actually might work though, because my friend had a 203 and a 209, but the 203 was miles bigger. Like, longer wise. Length of the horn and stuff. Okay, so that makes a little bit of sense, but in order to be 200 plus, I think the length of the horn has a lot to do with it, right? Uh, it makes sense that if the horn's gonna be longer, like, go you know, from a realistic standpoint, the longer the horn gets, the thicker it gets, right? Right, right, right. Just as they're getting older. Mm -hmm. uh, so I guess that's that makes sense. But, like, <laughs> nowhere on the scorecard is the length of the horn there. Uh, greatest spread and tip-to-tip -tip spread is there, but it specifically says not counted. Huh. I thought that was really interesting. And I guess, like, my 228, if you were to look at it side-by-side -side with the, what was it, 234... You could probably make the argument that the 228 is bigger, but with the way they're scored, the 234 has definitely got more massive horns. Right, right. Well, like when I got the first 222, that um, probably would have been the first dream that I did. Hmm? He looked huge, and then when I saw another one that scored like 221 or something like that, he looked just as big. But then when I saw, when I got the 237, I thought he was going to be like a 220s or maybe the same score. He didn't look any bigger than the other ones. Yeah, and I've actually had a couple now that were 180s that I, w I would have easily put above like the 200s that I've killed because they're just way wider and longer, but apparently they're not as thick. Oh. See, I don't think I've even gotten a 180 in a while, so I don't really know what they look like, but I guess they look just like a 200, huh? Yeah. Yes, Jared, I'm still bragging about my 234 that I only shot once. He's the one that <laughs> shot the 235 five times. Oh, really? Yeah. <laughs> nice. Nice. What weapon was he using? Uh, uh, inline and 454, and then 340, I think. Really? Yeah. It died of lead poisoning, actually, but <laughs> we didn't have to tell him that. <laughs> That's funny. So I thought we were kind of veer back. Uh, southeast yeah. a little bit here. Five because... times gave it that extra weight. <laughs> <laughs> what was the weight on it? I think it was, he said it was over 1,100 kilograms, I think. 1,100 plus. Yeah, it's, it seems like all the 220 pluses are over 1,100 kgs. I've noticed that too. Mm -hmm. So just imagine you're, when you get your tracking up really high for a water buffalo, you'll be able to track them. Pretty much, yeah. I mean, I don't know what kind of weight estimate you'd get at level 20, but you could get something like 1,000 to 1,200. That's the one you track right there. Buck. I didn't hear it. White tail buck right here. Nice. Yep. Someone's asking, do you remember Superman 10 and would you play with him again? Uh, I do remember Superman 10. We had a lot of hunts with him. Yeah, for sure. And actually, I think it's his birthday today, if I'm not mistaken. What? Yeah. Popped up on my phone telling me that. Oh, uh, okay. It was white toe. Did you get the call? No, I didn't. I don't even know where it says. Is it your marker? Right on the marker. Perfect. Should we call you it? Uh, yeah, sure. It is tomorrow. I think technically, like, 
I, if I remember right, he's an hour or two behind me, so it's today for me, but it might still be tomorrow for him and you. <laughs> what is going on in the chat? Should I execute even with my moderator wrench? Probably not. Yeah, I thought it was uh, 11 o'clock for you guys. Hey, welcome back, Lil Bass Pro. Uh-oh. You're in your Be Right Back screen on my end. It'll come back. Yep, it's back. Oh. We well, need to be careful, because this box is going to be right up here. Yeah. Don't what kind of phones do we it. have? Yeah, I don't want to get too close, is right. <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah. Are uh, you an Android user or iPhone? I am an Android user. I don't even know. What do I have? A Galaxy S4? I'm getting a new phone here in oh, approximately a week. Oh, so. wow. Christmas uh, present? Yes. Nice. Moto something X or whatever. I don't even know. <laughs> I have the have? iPhone. I have the iPhone 6s Plus right now. Nice. Does it have the what's that called? The the screen that goes to the edge of the phone. Uh, no, it doesn't go all the way to the phone. Okay. But it's still pretty big. Yeah, yeah, definitely bigger than the the uh, S4 that I have. Finally got the call from that guy. Yeah. Didn't move very far. No, he didn't. I like how Flinter just wings it with the clothes. You mean like what I'm wearing in the Hunter? This is what I always wear. What do you mean? Flinter, you should buy DVDs. <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? Oh, Flinter the Best said that first. Yeah. I didn't see that. Flinter, I think you're thinking of the Galaxy Edge. Uh, My sister's got a S8, I think, and it's got the screen that goes all the way to the edge is the one I'm thinking of. And I actually, my brother's might as well. He's got the Moto X or whatever the heck I'm getting. I don't even know. <laughs> That's a big buck. Glad you can see him, because I can't. Oh. Oh, well. Ah, no points, but he's got a nice rack on him. 140 to 160. He looked, I could see a really good frame on him, but I just couldn't see, mm. you know, the tines or anything. Yeah, he's probably like 149 or 151. Yeah. Do you want me to take him with the inline? Uh, yeah, you still got the 45s loaded? Yeah, because you don't have yours loaded up, right? Yeah. I'm going to crawl over here so I can actually see him. All right, I can see him. Got Something him. else, Spook. Nice shot. Thank you. Uh, what was that? I think it was a doe. I saw it. I oh, saw okay. a tail going. Yeah, all I could see was his rack coming up over this rock, and I knew he was big. But... He was missing a few times. Yep. He has potential to be 160 plus, but he's not going to be. Yeah, I, I'd say low 150s at best. Plus, he has a couple of stickers on him as well. Yeah. Buck fever. Not today. What kind of bows do you all have? And what is your biggest deer with it? We talking real life again? I would imagine, yeah. Uh, hey, it was pretty close on the score. One fifty-three. Good buck. Couple of nice bucks, yeah. Good, real good buck. You want to uh, make it to a certain point? We have been in this map an hour. If you want to. Oh, okay. I was thinking maybe we'll go to this tent right here and then stop. Yeah, sounds good. Maybe we'll cross over to this other shore over here, because there might be some bull elk that we might catch. Okay. 
Anyway, uh, to answer the question, I've got a Hoyt MT Sport, and I guess I should answer that again, even though I've already mentioned it. My biggest buck with it is the uh, nine point that I mentioned, seventeen and a half inch spread, <laughs> which I don't know what it scored. <laughs> no score. way! That's why we get along. We both shoot Hoyt. Oh, do you shoot a Hoyt as well? <laughs> yeah. Sorry for interrupting you. Oh no, I was done. I have a Hoyt Katera. What was it? It's a Hoyt Katera. Ah. Is that a newer model? I don't even know. No, it, w it would have been... It's pretty old. I got it right out of high school, basically. Okay, it's actually older than mine, then. Yeah, for sure. Mine's something like 2010. 2000... It's got to be close to the same year as mine. Oh, okay. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I don't know why I'm thinking you're not that much older than me. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah, so mine would have been like 2009 or 2010 to also. But mine's custom. My draw is from... I thought I just saw a buck over there. Mine is a 70 to 80 pound draw on mine. Oh, nice. Yeah. Mine's maxed at 70. Well, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's more than enough. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Half of the time, I look over to the chat, and I don't even know what's going on. <laughs> All I see is something, how much meat flinter. Yeah, I don't remember how much meat was on that buck. 50 pounds or so. I, don't, I, I knew I saw remember. something. That's yeah, a buck. Something? Buck just kicked up. Oh, did he spook? Yeah. I'm blind, dude. I haven't seen, like, half of these animals. Like uh, that bear, you had ten shots off before I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> he was really hard to see, though. But he might stop right on the island out there, and we might be able to get a decent shot on him. Yeah, we can probably see him from up here. I don't know if he was a 120s or 150s buck. I couldn't quite tell. You lose 1,100 kilogram water buffalo on the regular. It's true, but when I do shoot him, I only use one shot. So, I mean, you know, can't see him. <laughs> I can't see a whole herd of one-ton buffalo as they walk across. Did you see the um, 230? Oh, they're right there. See them? I see something. Oh, yeah? No way. There's two bucks. Two bucks. How cool That's is that? That's kind of cool. That's really cool. They're exactly the same size, too. Shall I load with yeah. 45s? Yeah, load up your 45 uh, sabots. How cool is that? The I'll only thing, down. what? The only thing cooler in this game with whitetail uh, that we've seen was three sleeping side by side. Three bucks. Yeah, and then tracking the wrong one in one of my videos we did. <laughs> it was like a 120 that was 85 to 100, and we tracked it for way too long. Oh, really? Yep. Yeah, it looks like two 110, 120 bucks. Yeah, both are about the same. Can't even count down right now. We'd, well, might be able to sneak a shot under that one. I don't know. There's a good spot right here if you want to lay down next to me. Yeah, up here in the on the beach thingy. Yep. Oh, I'm gonna not shoot from here because I'll probably hit that rock. A real good spot right here. Yeah. Which one are you taking? I'll take the front one on the left. Okay. Oh, uh, never mind. Yeah. You're stopped. If this one will stop, we can probably... There we go. Alright, you ready? Yep. Alright, one, two, three, shoot. Oh, Definitely the timing, mine. though. Did you hit yours good? <laughs> it dropped, yeah. I uh, hit a little bit high. Oh, you just piled up right there. Nice. Sweet. Yeah, we had good timing there. I decided not to wait for you on that one, and we shot at the same time anyway. Yeah, I kind of had to shoot quick. Yeah. 
He was like right behind that rock. Hang on, there's I just saw something trotting. Oh, there's an elk. I can't shoot it anyway. It's a female. Oh, okay. That's all right. Yeah. That's perfect, because this is pretty much where we wanted to get to anyways. Yeah, we can pop on loggers and we'll be good to go. Yeah. Get ourselves a 400 plus non-typical mule deer. Oh, for sure. Two of them in the same group, actually. <laughs> if that actually happens, now we're going to be called hackers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no kidding. Hey, BH, good to see you again, too. 123. Yep. And some lung blood here. Look at the weight, though. 80 to 90 kgs. Yep. That would have been one that we could have wasted time tracking if we came across it. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. What kind of arrows do you all use? I use a... Uh... Carbon Express, what are they called, War Wolverine Hunters or something like that? I don't know, it's like a, a not crazy expensive type. Nice. Do you see the hole in this? Uh, nope. Oh yeah, you can't see that. It's I interesting. I can see it on your stream. Because it's like right on the... T oh, you can see that. Yeah. Do you see how high it is? Yeah, that's close to being over the lungs, isn't it? But there was a rock, maybe like an inch below that, covering up the whole uh... bottom end. And yeah. all I could see was the top part. So basically the top inch of his lung and the spine is what I could see. So it worked out pretty good. Yeah, 86.2 kgs too. Not bad. Well, that means we would have tracked him for sure. Yeah, probably. Would not have been good. No. All right. Well, do you want to head over to Logger's Point? Yep, works for me. All right, well, let's go head over there, and we'll be right back. Are you there? Yep. Okay, cool. So let's set up loggers point. And Where everything sh should be the same. Let's spawn in the south tent. Okay. Yeah, south tent. Yeah, that's a really good spot. <laughs> Zach's stalking you. He can hear you clicking. All right, so we should be back now. <laughs> Red neck hillbilly. I can hear everything. <laughs> I can hear colors. Wow, CV Ender Pig Gaming. That's awesome. I don't even know what's awesome. I didn't get to see it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, the map's up. Okay, cool. I can smell colors. They'll hear you. <laughs> I don't know who it was. I can smell antlers. <laughs> yeah, I guess not. You probably hear me, actually, unless you've muted the entire stream. Uh, 
Oh, okay. I don't know then. <laughs> no idea. Hmm. Are we switching weapons? Because we're being asked to. Alright, now we're back. So you guys probably couldn't hear us. <laughs> yeah, you definitely couldn't hear us. Okay. Sign language. <laughs> well, nobody said they couldn't hear us, so how are we supposed to know? Yeah. Yeah, let's switch. Okay. Switch it up. Do we go with the 10 gauge then? Maybe somebody bring a 10 gauge. Yeah, let's bring 10 gauges. Okay. I thought you might want to bring your panther. Ooh, I do actually. Do you want to take your 10 gauge? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'll bring it. I'll bring the 10 gauge. The best weapon. Then I guess I'll bring my 22 for little creatures. Oh, what about the 357? Uh, can't shoot. Um, Bobcat. Ah, jeez. Well, I guess I'm not shooting little creatures unless I get them with a bow. You have your Bobcat collar? Got it. Nice. I think they uh, changed that feature. At first, you could, if you um, left your electronic color on a map it would like come back if you clicked on that loadout but now it doesn't seem to do that so mine's just stuck on Ruguru Bayou that's interesting 17 HMR for little creatures yeah but then I really can't bring my um, 6.5 and pulser at least not have them in my slots already I'm bringing the 10 gauge with some slugs oh yeah All right, I'm all set. The heck? Oh, we're under the power line. I just heard that noise. Doing the thing again. He's free looking so he doesn't spin though. Well, someone said they couldn't hear anything, so I was checking to see ah. what was going on. And it should be not muted now, so you should be able to hear. All right, so hopefully people can hear. Yeah. There's no way you can actually find out either, huh, Hunter? Me? Yeah. I could tab out and uh, unmute the stream. Yeah, check it quick. All right. Watch my game crash. It's not like it's that big a deal. You could just join back in. <laughs> yeah, I hear both of us just fine. Oh, you can hear us? Cool. All right. I'm kind of hoping yeah, that yeah. they put a scope on this 10 gauge soon because it just seems like it needs one. <laughs> as far as you can shoot it, couldn't hurt, but I don't know, game balance, that might really not happen. <laughs> True. Thank you, Chicago. All I can hear is Flinter taking a dump? What? <laughs> How did you know? That's just weird. <laughs> How did you know my recording studio is in my bathroom? <laughs> cool, was it the you. echo? Maybe. <laughs> um, that is getting too weird for me. Yeah. I've got a pheasant and I got nothing but a bow to shoot it with. It's it, actually down over the hill. It would be cool. Well, actually, what about, couldn't you bring your pistol with? Your twenty two? Uh, my twenty two. Mm-hmm. Or don't, seven. don't you have enough room? Nah, I'm, I'm full. Oh, okay. All right, let's leave it then. Yeah. Do you still have the camel, or I mean the pulser? Yep. All right, do you use the black one or the camel one? I've got the camo one, it just looks better. Yeah, that's what I thought. Yeah, I always use the camo one too. I've got a thousand kills with all of them, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. I'm gaining no hunter score from any of them.
All right, well, we're in a really good spot, so we should start hunting right away. Yep. It's an excellent spot for a big whitetail. I remember also, chasing a mythical non-typical down here for hours one time and never finding it. A mythical non-typical? Yeah. Melanistic? No, someone told us there was one down here, and I don't think it was actually oh. a non-typical. Hey, Jared, thank you so much. That was really cool of you. Wow. Did you see that pop up? Yes. That's awesome. That is awesome. Wow. Probably for the new weapon we're going to get next week. <laughs> <laughs> we probably will, too. Like a, something else we can hunt buffalo with. I mean, there's plenty enough high-powered rifles out there, isn't there? There is. Wait. Plenty to add or plenty we already have? Uh, I mean, there's always more you could add, but I feel like there's quite a bit of high-powered weapons out there to begin with. Yeah, there's only three you can uh, hunt buffalo with, though. Well, four. Oh. Four non-premium, if that makes sense. I think it's 4570 buffalo, 4570 government or whatever. Uh, 340 and the 50 in line for some reason. Interesting. The white tail doe way up there. The 416. Yep. I quite honestly think we're getting that. Is and that like I have an to elephant? Make another... Is that like an elephant gun? Uh, I don't know what people actually hunt elephants with. I know it's definitely like a large safari animal gun. Oh, okay. So, a single shot? I want to say... And I could be wrong about this, that it's a double barrel rifle, but I think it's a side by side. So sort of like I could the, be completely wrong. Like the thirty R but bigger? Yeah. Okay. Four sixteen hoarded three round clip? Okay. That's either a different model that I'm thinking of or just the one I'm thinking of doesn't exist. But I'm I'm pulling info from like Cabela's African Safari from like fifteen years ago. Oh yeah. There's a, a there's a Wii like that. A Wii? What? Yeah, a a Wii. Yeah. Oh, okay. Or what are you talking? PlayStation? Uh, yeah, PS2. Oh, okay. Yeah, no, there's one on Wii too. Okay. Same game. It... Yeah, I know I'm talking about the caliber, but. I don't know. I didn't know if anybody made it double barrel, but evidently they do. Mm. 700 Nitro Express? I don't wow. think that's what I'm thinking of. <laughs> that's an elephant gun, though. Is it? I bet. Oh, okay. So that's what, a huge caliber. What are we doing? We're waiting for this doe or something? or? What? Uh, I don't know. Are we shooting it? Mm -hmm. I was waiting for you to say what we were going to do. Oh, I was waiting to see if we could find something to shoot. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was kind of thinking we'd ignore that, but when you started calling, I thought we were waiting. Well, I was hoping that there might be a buck in the area, but there wasn't. Yeah, there's some pretty good games. Oh, yeah. I thought it was a 600 in African Safari. Was it a 700? I don't even know if 600 is a thing, but I just remember 600 for some reason. Yeah, I don't remember what it is, but I have the control for my Wii somewhere around here. <laughs> there's definitely a 500 uh, caliber pistol. I don't know if there's a rifle, though. You watch, uh, oh my gosh, what's the name of that channel? Demolition Ranch? Yeah, for sure. <laughs> he shoots that 500 and he says he hates it every time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I saw the last one, well not the last one, but the last one I saw was where he tested out to see if the airplane windows were bulletproof. I didn't see that one. Were they? Well, that would be a spoiler now, wouldn't it? I guess so. Is there something down there? I used to have a stand down there. It's a great spot. It's a tree. But that's a tree. I already know. Uh -huh. 
Because I had a tent, like, right up on this hill. And the first five or six times I spawned, I was like, oh, there's a deer. Nope, that's the top of a tree. Yeah, I sort of want to go on the back side of this doe. Mm -hmm. To get this direction over here. It was a 600? Okay, I didn't even know if 600 was an actual caliber. So it was 2017 and 2013? I didn't even know there was a dangerous hunt. Oh, wait. I don't think... I don't think that Cabela's has made a hunt the game since like 2014, so I don't think he meant oh, okay. to say 2017. So he meant 2013. Yeah. yeah. Yep, Matt from Demolition Ranch. Oh, yeah. Stupid thumbs. How did you miss the three by that much? <laughs> <laughs> Misfire. Fun fact, my the Hunter username comes from Dangerous Hunts 2009. Oh, that's awesome. The guy, the main character that you played as his name was Flint Abrams and Flint and Flint Abrams were already taken so went with Flinter <laughs> good choice coyote there's a male well somebody's got buckshot so yeah but someone doesn't have a coyote call on them I got it oh nice <laughs> nice let's load some buckshot up yeah I'm gonna try to find a spot we can actually see from Maybe if there's multiple, I can get one with the 6.5. Yeah, why not? Wow, this is not a great place to lay. I guess this can kind of work. Yeah, it could work. You want to try to get up where the hill starts going down a bit? To I your see right? One, actually. To your, oh, you see one? Yeah. Might be alone. Not even close to being big. I'll just start calling because it looks like it's by itself. Alright. Do you think he's a little First, too far to hear the call? Nah, it should be fine. Okay. First Dangerous Hunts was lit. I don't know if I have the first one or the second one on the original Xbox, but I played the heck out of that game. Hey, Dylan. Good thing we're wearing forest camo out here in the middle of the field. Well, at least we have the right camo on. <laughs> you have your werewolf on. Yeah, that'll bring the coyote right in. Oh, yeah. Like a decoy. <laughs> Let's see, which side's he going to come on? Ever side we're not looking at. Pro oh, there. Okay, I don't even see him, so. He's coming right down the middle. Right. right over the hill. Once you crouch up for a shot, I'll crouch up to try to see it. Okay, you ready? Oh, I hear him. Yep. Ready? I'm going up. Uh, don't see him. Going back down. Alright. I don't know where he is. Going back Sounds up. Like he's gonna spook. Uh, still don't see him. All right, he stopped, so he's gonna going spook soon, I think. Try and call one more time, maybe. I'm gonna do a short call so I can get my yeah six point five ready if he does run off. Yeah, try to, to hit him anyway. Up. Oh, there he goes. Saw that coming. Got a hit on him. Oh, <laughs> I was shooting over your shoulder, and I guess it didn't want me to take that shot. Yeah, I, I don't swear I had him too. I don't like that glitch. Yeah, I mean, I never, I don't even think you were in my scope at all. But it's a little bit yes. over the top, if you ask me. Yeah, I don't know what like the player hitbox is. Maybe it's a bit larger than you physically see, and that's probably the issue. Ooh, body blood. Yeah. Thought I had him again I'd... over here, though. Even if you didn't, that six point five buckshot is nasty. It might still go down. Oh, really? 
Three tracks of blood is a good sign, but it's still 71%. That's old. Old. Yep. Player hitbox is super wonky. Yeah. Yeah, that might not kill him, actually. That's an old one. Apparently he was spending all his time here. Also an old one. Not too old. Well. Trotting in, I guess. I'd say we're going to have to hit him again if we actually want to kill him. Yeah. Sucks, because I definitely would have got one in him with the 6.5 if it wouldn't have done that. Yeah, I know. Could have put a follow-up on him and... Yeah. That would have been perfect. One guy hit him and the other guy backed him up and got him down. Yep. Hey, Joey Edgar, welcome to your first stream. Just so happens that there's two of us here. Yeah. Alright, Kyle, have a good night. Till next time, try not to embarrass yourselves. Let's see how many people know what I'm talking about. Probably nobody. <laughs> 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 I'll give it uh, a minute or two and then if nobody says what it's from I'll explain brown paper bag of shame I'll add that in there too What kind of broadheads do y'all use? Rage, three blade expandables. Yep, I actually use the same thing. I have no idea. You're gonna spam memes on my Discord channel? Just use the banter uh, room and I don't care. Alright, it's a, uh, what I was <laughs> talking about is a NFL Network um, segment with Dave Damashek. He's just talking about the fails from every week, and most people hate on it, but I think it's hilarious. Oh, nobody knew what you were talking about? Yeah, I guess not. Ooh, I like that question. What is your dream hunt in real life? Yep. Just one, though. Dang. <laughs> Uh, if I had to choose just one, I guess it would have to be a red deer hunt in New Zealand. I would like to spot and stalk an old deer somewhere out west, but I just think red deer is so cool. Norway or New Zealand, but I think New Zealand may be better. Kitty cat. There we go. I finally have gender on bobcat calls. <laughs> it's taken so long. Of course, I just switched out to slugs, which is not going to work for a bobcat. That might be overkill. Yeah. But just by a little bit. Have a noise noit. Okay. We'll try. So this might work out here pretty good, actually. Yeah. I've definitely had worse scenarios calling Bobcat in. It's a nice About rock. half the time. <laughs> a nice rock right here. Maybe we'll put the call behind us? Yeah, perfect. No non tips yet. This Bobcat's going to be a non tip, though. Oh, for sure. These rocks are so cool, I really like them. Yeah, that's the one thing I'm a bit annoyed about with um, the new map. There's very little rocks and stuff that you can climb to uh, use. So is it just me or you can't climb up those uh, tree stumps? I know. Why I can't was you? so disappointed. They don't have a hitbox, you go right through them. Are they going to fix that? or? I guess not. I think they intentionally, like, it's kind of unrealistic to be able to climb one. So I guess it's intentionally keeping you from doing it, but... 
It was so useful. I see it. You have eyes? Yep, two of them. No way, two, two bobcats coming in? No, I have two eyes. Oh, uh, <laughs> that was a good one. I don't even have weight on them, but I, I know it's a male. That's about it. Oh, I see him. Uh, Joshua, if you're talking about ones with Zaggy K, I think we're gonna try to knock one out like Tuesday. We have, I think, uh, I won't spoil what the challenge is yet, but it's a good one. Oh, you're moving around. I, I thought the rock was glitching out with sounds. <laughs> I have three eyes. Maybe I do. I can't find another one. Just two. These bombcat take so long to come in. Yep, they take their time. And the thing is, if you didn't actually catch a glimpse of him coming up over that hill, you would you'd still be sitting here thinking like, is he gonna come mm -hmm. in or not? Yep, because now he's down out of sight. Exactly, for like another five or ten minutes probably. <laughs> long enough. Are you gonna do any special Christmas streams? Well, I guess that's directed at you, because I can't. <laughs> and beyond one, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Although there is Christmas stuff going on, so I don't know if it would be during the usual time. Right. It would have to be before or after. I haven't even decided what I'm going to do yet. Open some presents. There you go. Is he coming in yet? I'm sure it's made it 10 feet since I last saw it. Hey, there's Roasting Taco. That name is awesome. Sure has three eyes, and nine legs, zero eyebrows, and uh, hundred thousand siblings. Uh, the zero eyebrows thing could be reasonably accurate. My eyebrows are kind of light. <laughs> they used to be really light. It was almost completely true, like five years ago. Yeah, I heard the sun fades them out pretty good. Oh yeah. Well, they add not typicals to call the wild. You know, in the Somewhere in Call of the Wild, it actually mentions that deer can be... I think they use the word atypical in that game, if I'm not mistaken, but... I don't know if they'll be added at some point, but to my knowledge, no one has killed one, so I definitely don't think they're in the game. No, I don't either. They'd be in the forums, or someone would post something about it. You would think, yeah, someone would know about it. Yeah, I have done a face reveal cheese source. I did one uh, about a year ago. How strange of a person am I? Uh, I don't know. How do you answer that question? A little bit strange? Partially strange? There he is, there he is. What, coming up over the hill? Do you see oh, him? wow. Yep. Fill him with buckshot. Are you on him? Ah, uh, you can take him. Got him. You think? <laughs> I wasn't sure. Well, I didn't want him to run away. <laughs> it was like a 28, 30 meter shot. Oops. Yeah, 26-ish, yeah. 25.8. Hey, yeah. Nailed decent, that. Decent one, too. 18.2 kgs. Bad. 100 CSS? Wow. Yeah. Got liver, intestine, shoulder weight, stomach, hip bone, head, skull, right lung, left hind leg, <laughs> left front leg, left lung. So double lung, liver, shoulder weight, basically. And spine. would have been faster if you said what you didn't hit. It, that's true. It's always fun to take out a nice cat with a buckshot. Do you want to grab your collar? I always forget that. 
I forget it too, but for some reason I remember yours. Well, you can probably hear it calling too. Yeah, that helps. A lot of times I can't find it, so if I leave it on, I just run until I hear the sound, like really loud. And mm -hmm. then I find it. There it is. There's more cat tracks there. Yeah, there should be some bucks in this area too. Where are we now? Oh yeah, I love going up this side. Got a pretty decent non-typical, like a 240s or 250s over here not too long ago actually. I don't know when the last time I shot a non-typical on loggers was. I think it might have been one on your map. Like, a year and a half ago. <laughs> Whitetail are you talking? Yeah. Sounds about right. Five years ago, Flinter was eight. I don't think I'm 13, but sometimes I feel it. Also, I feel like I'm 45 sometimes, too, so. <laughs> Good combination. Yeah, when I roll out of bed and my back hurts, I feel like I'm 45. <laughs> right? <laughs> I have that same feeling every time I get in my car after I get done with the job. Oh, man. Yeah, I, I mean, I ain't working construction, but I'm on my feet all day and just... Oh, yeah. My back and my legs killing me. Same thing. There's your majestic... Yeah. That's actually a good question, Landon, because I don't know that they've said if the new map's coming out on console. I can only imagine that it will, but it's been out, like, what, two months now? I think it was mid-October. Right. So hopefully they're going to add it to console, because I think that'll be good for the community. they got to have at least close to as many console players as PC, if not more. So they might not add it? I think they will but it but seems like is there a possibility for them not to I guess like they haven't have they said that they're going to because no one seems true. to know that is true they didn't say that sometime in the near future they will do it it just mm -hmm. I mean you would assume because it's on PC but these kitty tracks are fresh we probably spooked it oh really yeah but you never know sometimes you get like the random ones that don't run off I just thought I'd crouching. Hold on, what do we have right here? Yep. Oh, you're not even looking where I was. It's a rabbit. I don't know what you're looking at. Oops, sorry. No, I don't Walking see it. Walking into you. What was that? Female hog. Oh, oh I might see the cat. Uh, right there. I do. No way. Yeah, I don't know if it'll come in. Is that it way out there? Yeah. Flatting along on my screen. I don't know what's happening. Can't even see it. What the heck? This looks bizarre. I don't know if you're seeing this, but... No, I don't see anything. It just... Did it... What was that noise? I swear I just heard it make a sound and watched it make a sound, but nothing came up in my hunter mate. I can't even see it. Right there, a female, like in the, the grass there at the end of the hill. Okay. Oh, it just disappeared on my screen. I don't know where it went. You think we should walk up to like that next small hill in front of us and then try to call it in? Put the collar out, yeah. Maybe you could just try the 357. Yeah. You start this game at seven. Uh, yeah, seven o'clock. 
I just was thinking, did you actually start Red Feather at 7 as well? Yeah. Oh, then we were actually on that map for almost an hour and a half. Oh, okay. I was starting to realize something wasn't adding up with when we started and what time it was. <laughs> <laughs> Not, oh, I might have been hallucinating a little bit, but my cat was like floating. It was amazing. Yeah, somewhere down here, if we can find a spot to go prone, you could probably put the collar out wherever. As long as you're right to go back and get it. Yeah, put it somewhere you can see it. <laughs> yeah, I was put it in a spot where I can't see it. Yep, always in the thickest grass because you hear one call, and what else can you do? Yeah. Oh, I forgot I can turn it on in multiplayer. Cool. Wait, what? I can turn your collar on. I do see the cat right now. So. You can turn the collar there. on? Yeah. No way. I didn't know that. Yep. I hear it. Though. You didn't turn it on, did you? No. Yep. Oh, there's our piggy, too. Oh, please don't come this way. I'd much rather a, a furry cat than a pig. Oh, for sure. Do you see the cat still? So? Yeah, if you come to where I'm at, I mean, I can't actually see it at the moment. Yeah, I can. I'm about it's three just... meters away from you. Yeah, you see that big rock on the side of the slight hill there? It's just below the rock walking. Oh, yeah, yeah, I the see. Call. Pig's right here, too. Yeah, I don't want to shoot it even with the bow because it'll probably run. Right, right. There's the cat right there coming up over the hill. It looks like a little bit of a decent one. Yeah. The female, but oh, it is. Yeah, yeah I don't. Not... I don't even have a weight estimate, but I thought when I first saw it that it was a male because it looked large. But maybe ten to twenty, looks... ten to twenty-five kgs. Oh, okay, that's not bad. Yeah. So, how close do you think she'll come? Uh, well, I'm just realizing there's a lot of grass. Right on my dot is 44, so if you could take her right there, it's probably your best bet. Yeah, I'm thinking... Yep, right before she starts getting into the grass here. Yeah, see, try and put your mark there and see where it comes out. Yeah, I got 42, 43. Yep, same spot. You're going to have to go with that. Yeah. I just saw someone mention... Uh... This game with Call of the Wild graphics, I think that's probably my dream game because I like the consistency of this game. Mm -hmm. But gosh, Call of the Wild looks so good. True. Oh, well, look can... at him! She stopped. Yeah. Oh, that's nice that there's a little plant in my way. I'm gonna scoot over to this side. All right, somewhere in there, I think. All right, take take her when you can. Nice. I wasn't even sure. I I never shoot fire with this gun. Wasn't sure if it would go down. I don't even know how she went down. You must have caught long at that range, huh? Yeah, I guess. Not any deer around here, but we've got plenty of bobcats, apparently. Yep. Yep. Both lungs, stomach as well. Yeah, I thought that was going to be like a seven female. Nice. 13.5 kg. Hey, you remembered. Yeah, I was about to just run over there and be like, oh, wait, I forgot the color. <laughs> Got a 100 by 100 elephant in Canada. Canadian elephants. I didn't know that was a thing. See, I sort of want to try and find a heavy white tail track right now and see if we can't track one down. Yeah. At this point, we might track a 50 to 65 white tail male. <laughs> <laughs> well, it just goes to show you how hard it is to actually find an untypical, and there is no real way to do it. You just gotta keep trying. Exactly. What we probably should have done was name this something like hog hunting or bobcat hunting, and that's when we'll find a non-typical. Very true. Or rabbit hunting. Yeah. 
We named it Rabbit Hunting. Zaggy would be in here watching, I bet. <laughs> That's what he does best. Oh, he likes rabbit hunting? Yep. Oh, okay. I feel like it's not a very um, popular map. Well, not map, but I guess animal species to hunt. Mm-hmm. Uh, J-Rod that we hunt with a lot loves rabbit hunting, too. No, I know some people like it, but I I would say, like, overall, it seems like most people don't like it that much. Yeah, I'm like, if I see a rabbit, I'll shoot it, but I'm probably not going to go hunt them. Yeah, that's kind of how I am, too. Oh, he's talking in real life with a 22 Ruger. Yeah. I actually haven't even um, rabbit hunted hardly in real life at all. Only shot one. I feel like you have to live right in a really populated area for rabbit in order to hunt them. Yeah. Or okay. kitty tracks. Jared wants to see your map set up for loggers. Sure. So, it used to be a little bit better than this, but for the most part, got a few stands over here. Double stand there, and a little bit of a dry setup there. A couple more stands spread out. I think we have six or seven tents. Actually, one, two, three, four, five. Seven tenths. Putting that auto walk function to good use. Hey, thanks. You look like you're about to fall asleep on your keyboard, apparently. <laughs> hey, Zach, you wanted to know about how strange you are? <laughs> Pretty strange. But I mean, yeah, I am tired because I worked all day, too. I've got a screwed up schedule. I went to bed at 7 o'clock yesterday morning, so oh, really? I'm not tired yet. <laughs> yeah. He says yes. And caps as well. I feel like that was another fresh cat track right here. It was a tiny one from the looks of it. Oh, really? Just like the general side of the track looked really small. This is such a, <laughs> such a good area here. You know, I haven't yeah. hunted this area, I don't think, once since the cats came out. What did they just pass? Is it a shroom or a shed? That's eh, a shroom. Boring. That had to be a bobcat. What? I just heard like a cat sound. Like, meow. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what I heard with that other one. So that's the bobcat? Yeah, it sounded almost like what the lynx sound like in uh, Call of the Wild. But there's no location of it. No, I didn't I didn't get a, anything on my hunter mate. You want to, like, stick the collar out and see what happens? Yeah, why not? Where did you get a predator collar? I thought you didn't have one. Oh. I guess when I loaded back into this map, it brought one with. Ah. Just means it's close by, Jared says. Oh, okay. So we should probably go prone. By close by, I guess, like, the one that I watched do was 180 meters away, so. <laughs> I don't know that they meow and spook either because, like, that one came right in when we did that. Yeah, true. I wouldn't mind seeing a deer, though, wow. <laughs> Yeah, we'll have to take a keep an eye out, out out here in this valley. Yeah, I'll watch this side. Oh, buck, buck, buck! Way out in the distance. Is that a Down melee? Or probably. Yeah, that's a melee, like a 140s melee. Way I'm out there. Trotting. 200 plus meters out. I was trying to get on him, but I just couldn't quite get on him. Yeah, he went out of render, didn't he? Yeah. I 
It was so hard to see him. Yeah, there was no shooting that one. Uh, we have something right here on top of us. I don't know what it is, but there's something coming in. You hear it? Yep. Alright, I hear it too. I don't know I think if it's, it's a cat. It is? Oh no. It's a buck. I thought I heard, um, like the cat sound, but yeah, it's definitely a buck. I can't see it though. Trying to crawl to where I'll actually be able to watch you shoot it. I do a buck shot in, so that's a good thing. Yeah, that'll help. That would definitely help, because actually buckshot is perfect for this territory right now, for this terrain. Because I can't even see him. Definitely down the hill. But where? That part I can't answer. To the left a little bit, it sounds like. I almost wonder if he was in the same herd as the one that I saw, like, way out of there on render distance. I don't know. Well, I found your problem is why you can't see him. <laughs> why? All this brush and stuff. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Like, it's perfect for buckshot right here. Wow. He's really hidden. Turn around. Uh, I can't see the cat color from here. It almost sounds like there's a couple of bucks coming in. You might want to get your 6.5 out to back me up. Oh, I forgot I had that. I was going to get my 357 if I saw it. <laughs> I don't know. I was still thinking I had the inline with 50s. No, because you'll be able to shoot across this whole valley here. Yeah, if he busts up. But I don't and know if he's like stuck on a rock or what's going on. I'm starting to think that that's a possibility. But it sounds like he's covering distance, but we've heard him walking so much he should be here by now. That or he's just taking his time. Yeah. Couldn't be in any thicker of a spot if it really wanted to. Yeah. There's only a few spots like this on this whole map, and he found one. <laughs> so what you should do is swing around to the left side over there, try and get up that hill, okay. and see if you can't kick him out into this open over here so at least someone can get a shot off. Because I don't think right. he's coming in. I think he's kind of stuck. I'm thinking he's stuck. But he's stuck within like 20 or 30 meters away. Yeah. So if we kick him up here, he's going to run right into the brush and nobody's going to see him. He's going to run straight away, you mean? Yeah, exactly. So maybe if you can get over there to that hill, maybe you could even spot him from over there. Yeah, I'm thinking that might happen, but <laughs> I can't see much better from over here. You can't? No, not at all. It's actually worse. <laughs> I want to make sure oh, I'm over boy. here far enough. Yeah, exactly. If you're far enough over, then it will kick back this way. And Like I said, I have buckshot here, so... Be in a pretty good situation. Did I just stand up and run at him, you think? Just get a little bit further over. Yeah, I'm getting down like behind him pretty much. Yeah. Yeah, he's definitely in front of me now, so... Alright, go for it. Going. Oh, I spotted him, he's tiny. Oh, hello. I just stepped on him. Can barely even see him. Oh, there he is. Get him! Oh, that's the end of the hill. I 
I don't even see him. Did you hit him? I don't think. It kind of looked like it, but I don't, if I did, it was body. I don't even think I hit him. Probably gonna stop right down there. Do you want to look for him or not really? Nah, I had 70 to 95 when I ran in there. He was so tiny. Uh, yeah. Well, at least the bobcat's probably gone by now. I would think so. <laughs> we may have shot a few times. Oh, sliding down the hill. He walked into World War Three and walked right out of it, too. Definitely can't find the car. Uh-oh. You're really close. <laughs> I feel like it's right here. I can't there even see a... it, but I can hit this mantle, so I guess it's good enough. There was a buck sleeping right here, a tiny white tail. A different one? Yeah. Oh, buck call. Okay, didn't hear that. White tail buck. Back that way. Right on my dot. Alright, coming back up out of here then. We can ignore these tiny ones. Yeah, no kidding. Actually, this is his track right here. What do you got weight wise? I'll check. Decent. 80 to 100, I guess. Yeah. It's one of those where it could go either way very easily. Mm hmm. I can't believe that buck got away after all that. <laughs> well, these cat track was kind of big. They're heading this way, too. Very true, Jared. <laughs> oh, that cat was coming in, too. Oh, no Ooh, way. Big tracks. I got 85 to 100 on that buck. Really? Yep. Did you get that? Yeah, he's right on the road there, apparently. Yep, right on the road. It's nice having level 20 tracking and actually being able to trust that ping and like on the new map everything's way off. <laughs> Very true. Actually, if we can call him over to here, we can get over there by those hills. Do you see it's a nice little opening over here? Oh yeah. Hey Ashton, good to see you again. Yeah, these are almost like lookout spots. Yeah, it's pretty nice. Although you can't see him until he gets about 50 meters from you. Yep. One fifty to one seventy on spot. I say we're about to have one seventy to one ninety five. Probably gonna be like a one twenties. Probably. Should probably load up the gun too. Time. That might help. <gasps> the the misadventures was... of DD thirty three in Flinter. Find out next time. Do you have a good spot there? Yep, I can see fine. I'm not in a very good spot. Oh, this is better. Oh, is there grass on yours? There was, yeah. I'm, I'm a lot better here, though. Okay. Should we put out a grunt or no? Uh, yeah, we've been calling it. Right? Mm-hmm.
He called again. He's definitely coming in. Oh yeah, I see that. Okay. I know the answer to that joke now. <laughs> Another call? Yeah, that's a bit weird. That's like three or four calls now. Uh, that's probably the third, like, actual one since he called again for me after you heard him. Hmm. Know what I mean? Yeah. I just put out a grunt. I see him. Well. <laughs> There's your buck. A brute of a 122 score. Are you on him? Yeah. As he walks down over the hill. Got two of them. My guess is that you got body because it was shoulder blade. Yeah, it wasn't a very good angle. That 357 is so dang loud. It sure is. Body. Yep. But there's a dead buck right here. Oh, really? Yeah, I hit him twice. Guess that second shot was enough. The first shot was neck and then body. Oh, okay. So, you want a fast travel or something? Because, like, this hasn't been working. Yeah, we're not having very good luck here. You want to check out for some muleys or? Yeah, we could do that. Go up to the north end? Yeah. Right. Go to the tent or the lodge? Well, I don't have any camp supplies on me right now. Oh, okay. Because they weren't saved in my loadout and I don't have them on me. Ah. I had them when we were on Red Feather, but then once we switched here, I hit bow set up and I don't have them anymore. Oh, okay. So we could go to the south lodge and go north from there. Or go to the North Lodge and go South. I'd be down for South Lodge because that's kind of both species, kind of. Yeah, true. All right. Why do scuba divers fall backwards off the boat? Because if they fall forwards, they're going to fall into the boat. Try to trick me with your jokes. <laughs> sort of want to take more of a long-range shooting gun. Yeah. Like the 223. Yeah. Actually, let's go 243 because we can use it for a muley. We can use it for a bobcat. Is it legal for bobcat? 243? Yeah, I never even thought of that. Yep. And you can use it for whitetail. Yep. I know you can't use it for feral hog. When I was a guest, I bought a one-day feral hog membership or uh, license, and I was very sad when I got everything disqualified that I shot. <laughs> that is kind of sad. I mean, they give you this gun, but you can't even yeah. use it. <laughs> exactly. Why can't dinosaurs clap? I don't know. Their arms are too short. <laughs> I don't know. Poor Flinter.
Alright, never mess around. Have a good night, and thank you so much for the luck. We need it. <laughs> yeah, I was gonna say we might. Actually, we do need it. Yeah, this spot here, it's kind of... You never know if you're going to get a big white toe or a big mule. It could be either. Yep. I got... What was it? A 217. When I had that streak, of three really big mule deer bucks. In a few days, I shot a 217 right up here. Wow. Then, when I was on uh, EW stream last week, I had a 160s white tail right ahead of us. They're, they're extinct. <laughs> yeah, it's hard to clap when you're dead, that's true. Zach's dead on the inside. Pac-Man Hunter, I think I know you. It depends on which Pac-Man Hunter it is. Are there several? There could be another one. Okay. But most likely it's probably the same one. I think this may be the same Pac-Man Hunter that was with me when I shot the uh, albino mule deer oh. on this map. Probably. Hey, Todd Whitman. Oh, you're going up the road? I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> I was like, I guess we're spreading <laughs> out. <laughs> Trying to spread out our luck a little bit more. Maybe we should do that, at least if one of us gets a call. Then we can reconvene. Alright, we'll stay like 100 meters apart. Yeah. It's me. It, it's me. Is that pink glowing antlers actually a thing? Because I have not seen that, and I actually want to. Well, the hunt is going. It's going, I guess. You could uh, yeah. Say that, but someone's asking to have a hunt with us. I would recommend hunting by yourself from the way this is going. Yeah. We've killed exactly three animals in an hour. <laughs> Mostly bobcat, huh? Two of them were bobcat, yeah. My name is Glimpter now, apparently. Close, but no cigar. Hey, thank you, Ryan Christensen. We'll definitely try to. Yeah, that was deleted pretty fast. I was actually going to compliment whoever was uh, modding because they've been doing really well. Things are anything that's not appropriate is gone immediately. Oh, of course. I have amazing mods. But I didn't know. I feel like sometimes. Doesn't even the computer just censor things out like that, too? Uh, I think they can censor stuff, but I don't think they delete things. Oh, they just they just kind of, like, notify it. Yeah. Did you hear about the burglars who stole the calendar? I, I don't even know how to answer that, because I'm sure it's a joke, but... Uh, no, I guess. <laughs> Got a track here. You should clip that, Zach. Rabbits. Frame it on your fridge. There you go. <laughs> yeah, I've got nothing but rabbit tracks, too. Maybe we should hunt non-typical rabbits. Technically, a male rabbit is called a buck, so we're still hunting non-typical bucks. Very true. Very true. Oh my gosh. <laughs> they each got six months. Clever.
Hey, thank you, BH. More rabbit tracks. You want to run a little bit? Yeah. We we should be able to run till something calls because I haven't even heard anything. Oh, oh. What? Something's right here. I think it's a doe, though. Okay. But at this point. Yep. It's fair game. I'll just wait till you shoot. And oh, start that was again. a good hit. I was shaking like crazy. Oh, you crouched? I was, yeah. I actually saw something else take off up in the distance. I'm not I sure. Had... If... Did you see it? No, I had tracks from a group in the old year does, though. Oh, okay. It was probably just another doe. Right. Oh, that's a 75 to 95 whitetail track. At this point, it might be worth following. Oh, for sure. 23 to 30 minutes. What's orange and sounds like a parrot? I don't know an orange parrot. I love this chat. It's amazing. <laughs> that was a good guess. <laughs> Got a nine-point typical this morning. Not typical apparently. Is oh, this. I didn't see that. It's getting pretty late. Whoops. <laughs> nice job on the non-typical. That's pretty sweet. I'm trying to think, what would that score though? Oh. 137 apparently. Apparently 137 and A. Yeah. Nice one. Apparently somehow that's body blood. I don't know. I don't know how, but. Apparently. I don't use Skype anymore. Skype did not like Windows 10, so. No. Either that or Windows 10 didn't like Skype. A carrot. <laughs> <laughs> I should have thought of that. Darn it. <laughs> oh. It's early in the morning in Norway. I think it is 8.17 a.m. in Norway. Am I right? Hey, Nick, oh, we got a buck. White tail buck yeah. grunted. Alright. It looks like we're going to have to separate on this one because I'm 12 to 19 from mine. Oh, okay. I think we spooked this one, maybe. If not, it was right by us. Probably. Hey, thank you, Ryan Christensen. I'm not really using... I, I have a Discord, but I don't really use it for voice communications that much. I actually use TeamSpeak mostly. I'll just, I've got the Discord that every now and then I'll jump in and talk to anybody that gets on. Hey, Pedro Soros. Um, should I call this buck right now? Or yeah, wait? Yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. You're 500 from me. You're fine. I don't understand where this buck was when we went through here. He was hiding in the brush. I guess. I got a solid circle. Like, we just went through there. Got another grunt. Right same in one? the exact same spot. Same one. But he did not move at all. Been up all night and you regret doing it? I literally just did that, except it was still seven, and then I passed out. Not actually passed out, but you know. Ah, uh, this dude was sleeping here and I bet you I spooked him. Got a stand right there. Or did I? Looks like he slept for like two minutes and got back up. <laughs> I don't even see this deer. I don't see mine, but I definitely spooked him. I didn't spook this one.
I don't alcohol. <laughs> I don't alcohol either. Okay, I hear something like right on top. But how did that deer get from there all the way over here? <laughs> Why did my buck run this way? So many questions. I guess he snuck in when I wasn't looking, I don't know. Why didn't the astronaut come home to his wife? Uh... I want to at least come up with an answer. Yep, I got nothing. Oh, mine just called again. Mine ran out in this open field, so hopefully I can at least see it. Still don't see him, though. Hey, crazy. Last time I saw you was when Zaggy helped me stream on my channel. There's something right here, and I think that's a doe. Yeah, it's a doe. Don't want her. That's whatever was walking by you? Yeah, that's what's walking, but I have eyes on whatever this is now. Okay. I can just barely see it coming through over here. It's what the heck? One. Okay, I've got 85 to 100 white tail track, too, that's old. Uh, it's a like old, old. 120's buck. Probably gonna use a 357 on this guy. He needed his space. I was gonna try to use space as the answer too, but I didn't think of that. 33. Jokes for days out here. Cause there there's go. not animals for days. Going loud. <laughs> Glad I'm far away from that gun, cause that hurts my ears. I thought I had a good hit on him, but. You took off. Is that my buck? Nope, that's a piggy. Good blood. Nice. Yep, yeah, he's down. Wait. This buck has no interest in dying on a live stream, apparently. 109. Did you get any fresh fleeing tracks? Yeah, I've got them going down like the beach area. Hey, thanks, Nick. I was actually trying to find a uh, camo headset. I want to get a wireless one, but I could not find one. Yeah, mine's like a white winter camouflage, I guess. Mm hmm. Why does this buck got to do this to me? Yeah, I'd say we got to be going close to three hours now. Uh, almost, yeah. Oh, he's actually going that direction. Not bad. See, I think I'm going to swing around and I'll meet up with you somewhere over there. Okay. It is a Sage gaming headset. Something, I don't remember what it's exactly called, but... I didn't even... I've got the same brand as you and I didn't even know it. Oh, really? Yeah. I don't know what mine's called either, other than the brand. Yeah. Alright, I'm about to give up on this buck and track the heavier one, because I've got his tracks again. Oh, you have two sets of tracks? Yeah. I've got an 85 to 100 here. Ooh. Like... I, if this one's here, I don't know where he could possibly be hiding it. I can't see him. Start running around loggers and actually find some stuff. 
Yeah, I'm getting rid of some shotgun ammo here and getting a 270 out. Ooh, that's a gun I haven't used in a while. Call the Wild 270 edition. You know, I, mean, I almost uh, used that exact gun the other day. Oh, really? Yep, I was going to get the, the Call the Wild out, and then I think I ended up just doing something. I didn't play the Hunter for some reason. Yeah, it's a really cool looking gun. Yeah, I like it. I think I've only got those first few kills I got in a video with it. It almost looks like a gun, like something like my dad would give me when I was 12 or something. Here, here's your first rifle. Yeah. You know, the camouflage is not very modern looking. It looks... Uh, just like a bunch of leaves and sticks on it. It's Compared a lot to... like... What? It's a lot like what I have on my... Uh... My inline, it's a camo color. What the heck? Yeah. Oh, I just spooked a bunch of mule deer does. So, more of like a mossy oak look. Or like, mm -hmm. maybe like 10 or 15 years ago. What their camouflage looked like. Yep. Or, I guess it might even called, isn't there one called tree bark camouflage? Like a brand? Yeah. I don't know. Just kicked up a couple of rabbits. Picked up a ton of does. Alright, Crazy McGrazy. What was that? So you're going that way. We're going to try and cut up, catch up to you in a second. Yep. I lost my tracks. I think he turned around because I had those old tracks. So I'm just going to look for something else. 60 minute old tracks. That takes a while to find. Oh, you can't find any fresh ones? Nah. Maybe I'll run into that other one that was heading this way. You're in a really good area for white tail there too. Oh yeah, this is definitely a nice spot. I just saw a pig down here, which is not quite a white tail. Something. Yeah. The living creature. That it is. seems so calm out here. Yeah, I think I'm about to shoot a doe just to do something. If I saw one, I'd probably try a shot. <laughs> I was going to shoot her with the pulser, but she started walking. Oh well. Maybe that'll actually stir up some animals. Yeah, get something kicked up besides rabbits. It's pretty yeah. much all I have over here is rabbit tracks. Might as well have rabbits down here, just a bunch of does. Well, at least you can shoot at a doe. True. Seventy-one kilograms. It's uh, kind of heavy though. If that counts for anything. Nice. <laughs> Zach. Um, yeah, world's first 12 day the hunter stream. We'll be here right up until Christmas, actually. You know what? That's not a bad idea. Maybe we could get one in... Let's see. I bet we could get one within... Well, I, I wouldn't start the stream at night. But if we started, like, early in the morning, we could probably get mm -hmm. one within, like, 48 hours. I would think so, yeah. If we really tried, probably could do it in one hunt. 
get a uh, white heart and just drive the heck out of it until one shows up. Oh, well, yeah, we could definitely get one right now, even if we just drove it within probably five or six hours. Yeah. But I'm thinking more like trying to find one hunting style versus uh. drives. So if we covered a lot of ground within 48 hours, I bet we might see one. But it's a lot of hours and a lot of hunting. I saw someone in the chat wanted you to ask me something, but since I can see the chat, uh, I can answer that. But the question was, uh, how does it feel for you to get a diamond moose and me to get a tiny diamond musk deer? <laughs> and the answer is, is with Zaggy. Mine was first. <laughs> Yeah, he had his diamond way before me. But the thing is, I actually could have had a diamond moose. I saw that. Did you see that? Just uh, yesterday, right? Yesterday, two days ago? Well, that would have been maybe my third one, but... Oh. Yeah. Well, because I was looking at... Uh, what was that video called? Um. Uh, like... I think I put like best hunt ever holy rack it was called oh yeah yeah you could have had that one too. that would have been diamond right yep and the one that me and you shot together with the bow was a diamond oh guarantee that was diamond for sure um but what? yeah then the one recently a few days ago missed that thing by maybe like an inch or two and it would have been a double lung shot I've actually got a buck oh you do yep Nice. It's uh, we're talking about Call of the Wild for those of you that are wondering. <laughs> um, someone asked what rank I am in Rocket League. I'm champion in twos and uh, I think diamond three and threes. I don't think anybody cares about threes rank though. Oh, nice BH. Wow. I've got an absolutely tiny white tail. Oh, well, I've got nothing here right now. Yeah. Where did he go? What did the buffalo say when his son left? Bye, son. Ha ha ha. Gotcha. I'm so glad this tiny buck's standing behind a tree so I can't shoot him. <laughs> Polo is a soda in Norway? Oh, if you were asking what my solo's rank is, it was Diamond 2 and then I stopped playing it, so it's probably Diamond 1 now. Because, like, I played... I'll play random, like, every now and then, but I don't consistently play it. I think it is down to Diamond 1. Yeah, Pedro, I have to agree with you there. A bit more action. A lot less talk and a little more action. Is that the name of that song? Yeah, that's country, right? Toby Keith, yeah. Oh, yeah. A little less talk and a lot more action. That's what it is. Well, when you got a 70 to 90 kg track and you think maybe you should track it, then you don't <laughs> know you don't know if you should keep hunting or not. Why was Zach buried alive? Uh, because he's dead inside? <laughs> I don't know. That's not one of those jokes you can look up on the internet and find the answer, so I'm going to be wrong no matter what I say. I'm not saying I was doing that. I'm saying that's where people were getting their jokes. <laughs> like their common ones. Let's see. Solid circle going this way. I've got a solid 35 to 60 white tail. I bet you see the one that I'm tracking right now. Did you get it? Uh, sort of. I hit it. Oh, maybe not. Hopefully one lung. I had to stand to shoot it. Oh, bit of a wobble. A little bit. I have a solid circle here, so there's no way it would have made it all the way over by you. Nah, shouldn't be it. I don't know why I'm getting all worked up over a 70 to 90 kg track, but 
because that's our non-typical. Uh-oh. What just happened? They're silent when they charge. I want to see this on stream. Oh, wow. You couldn't even, like, you never saw it coming. No, I didn't. Dang. Luckily, I'm literally, like, 20 meters away from the tent, so it wasn't that big of a deal. But still, it just wasn't cool. No, not quite. I don't know at what point they're going to re-add the hog charging sound, but that's really frustrating. <laughs> well, there is a tree stand here. Might just hop in it. Click what button? <laughs> Is she talking the subscribe button? That's a button that you should probably click. Yeah, for sure. I hear good things happen when you click that button. Oh boy. The bad button. The dislike button? It's going for a pretty good chunk of time, and actually the track from that buck is right here. Did you find your buck? Yeah, 53 score. Wow. Fleeing track, one to seven minutes fleeing this direction here. The button that makes the stream explode, that's probably a better button than most of the ones that we're getting, which is no animals button. The no animals button. Somebody press the no animals button and they need to unpress it. Thank you. <laughs> I was sitting in traffic the other day. That's probably why I got run over. That'll do it. <laughs> you at least got to stand up. Those big trucks will never see you if you're sitting down. Nope. I wish this hog would listen to my call. How far are you? Oh, I shouldn't shoot anyway. Never mind. That's alright, I'm gonna hop down. This buck is not coming in. Yeah, I wanna fast travel to that tent up, not the one that you're at, but the other one. Just see if I get a call. <laughs> Why do you got a wrench? <laughs> and I don't. <laughs> oh, it sounds funny. Yeah, I'm not gonna answer. <laughs> I'm not gonna say what I wanna say. <laughs> Hey, Lee Vanoy, thank you. Thank you so much. I have to, I need to wait zero minutes till I can fast travel. Gotta love that. Finally, thank you. Gosh. Oh, you're over oh, there. Oh, look, a doe. Yeah. It'll be a rare doe, though. Yeah. Anything you want. I don't even see her. She's do you like, so rare that she's invisible. What? Do you like country music? Oh, uh, yeah, that's usually what I listen to. Oh, I heard a kitty. Not like I can call it in. So well, hopefully you can spot it at least. I'm trying to bring it in with the predator call, but we'll see if that works. Yeah, I don't know how effective that really is. I thought it said, like, under 150 meters it works. If you're really lucky. Yeah, I've man. only successfully done it once and I didn't even shoot it because I didn't know it came in. <laughs> oh! Look at that! We just kicked up a bobcat right there. Bobcat drives. Never even saw him. Looking for this buck here and I can't find him. 
But he's gotta be yeah. down by the beach. Yeah. The only non-typical thing we've killed in this drive is time. And I don't know why time is not typical, but it is. <laughs> well, well, there's my doe that's definitely not a rare. Video freezes. That's not good. Norwegian internet. <laughs> um, oh my gosh, the cat's actually coming in. No way. Yeah, it's got me spotted. Take him. No. It ran away before I got on it. What the heck? I he oh, jeez, I'm calling in coyotes too. <laughs> Didn't think of that. Multiple coyotes. Not bad. No. I actually killed an animal. Look at that. Hey, nice. You also might have sent something my way, too. Missed that one. Yeah, you did. Got a hog running right at us. Eat him. But I was sort of looking for this buck. Oh, yeah. Why do you smear peanut butter on the road? I don't know. Can't come up with a witty answer for that. Well, I see a doe. Fun fact, I don't have any facts. <laughs> Just opinions. Alright, there goes this hog. Gone. Hey, thank you. I love how it just says, thank you, name of subscriber. It doesn't even have a name. <laughs> Bobcats trot? I never saw a bobcat trot before. I guess they do anything now. I finally got to see them uh, All right, I think I play see with the, the mouse. Oh, you watch nice. one play with the mouse? Yeah. To go with the traffic jam. Brilliant. Definitely have a highlight of the night right here coming in. That sounds sarcastic. I thought yep. it was a doe. That's how small this thing is. <laughs> Thank you. Enter name here. Let's see if we can't put a hit on him. <sighs> He's down. And we got a hog running on the beach. I felt the earth shake, it's so big. Oh yeah, he's a big one. <laughs> Where did the hog go? There he is. That buck suits me. I would probably take that buck right now where things are going. Nice. I wouldn't say very good, but he is hit. And I... I think he just went down. Can't quite tell. But it looks that way. Yeah, I think he's down. Wait. 270 has a pretty good little knockdown power to it, actually. Yeah. So, mark him. They're guessing it's 300 plus. They're gonna be close, that's a big one. I hope somebody just tuned in and thinks that we actually just shot a non-typical. Can't even find this buck, he's so small. I mean, <laughs> he's so giant. Right, his antlers are blending in with the grass. 53.8. Hey, mom is bigger. I have to say, I thought he was actually smaller than that. <laughs> I just had possibly the smallest whitetail buck track I've ever seen. 45 on the low end. It was actually a buck track or a doe? It was a buck track. Wow. Someone was in my red feather lobby, I think it was last night, and I'm pretty sure I saw a score of 22 pop up for a blacktail. Yeah, that's 
definitely reasonable. I've never seen one that low before. I I shot like a 24, I think. Yeah, I've seen 24, 25, but I feel like 22 and below has to be close to record breakers. Might be. Boone and Crockett, that, that's what that was right there. Yeah. All right, see you later, BH. Um, you know yeah, to... he's down. What was that? Wait. You know where to aim like 120 meters with the pulsar by chance? 120? Yeah. I mean, I could figure it out, but I don't have like a mark or anything. I'm going to use tracers and try to kill a bobcat at that range. Oh, really? This is an excellent way, if anybody's curious, to waste three tracer arrows. <laughs> Decent hog. I'm never going to hit this thing. I'm terrible long range with a bow. trying to think. I'll take a look at it and see what I think. Yeah, he's starting to walk now. Well, the peep can't... Sight covers up the whole thing. Exactly. You can't even see what you're aiming at. I would hey. say the bubble is close to 110 or something like that. Oh, that wasn't even close. <laughs> Alright. Uh, there. Nope. One more. Oh, <laughs> so close. I almost got it. That's the worst when you come so close and then you're like, oh, Out just one more, just one more. Next thing you know, your tracers are gone. I mean, I can use normal, normal arrows, but that's just probably not going to work. Yeah, because then you don't know where you're hitting. You can try to crawl to within 60, I guess. Can't you call him back in? Uh, he's still spooked at the moment. That's why I was shooting at him. Oh. You just shot a water buffalo with a bow and got heat stroke? That Can you actually sucks. die in that map? I haven't seen that. Well, I don't know if it has to do with if you have the right clothes on and camouflage, then you don't get affected as much. Clothing does matter. Oh, okay. But Just like, like white ram, sort of. Mm -hmm. I've been like pretty much running for an hour straight and not like had any indication that I was going to die. I've had like the, the wavy, blurry screen, but hmm. like, you know, a white rhyme, if you step in the water, it says your body temperature is dropping rapidly or something. Right. I never had anything like it's raising, rising, whatever, rapidly. Yeah, I've actually never even had the blurry screen come up yet. You'll get it on, like, the corners and stuff. If you look, uh, let's say you have an item out in the bottom right, you get the text. It'll start to, like, wave back and forth. You can see it really easily when you're, uh, running. Oh, really? Yep. The y'all like Call of the Wild? I think it's a really good game, but it needs more content. Free maps. Unfortunately, it gets a bit boring. Yeah, Bush Rangers does it as well. Both maps are supposed to. Wait, you get blurry on Bush Rangers too? Yep. You need the water bottle if you go on Bush Rangers now. Oh, they just added that. Mm hmm. Oh, okay. So what do they do to Call of the Wild? I noticed there's a new like multiplayer beta section. There. But honestly, go. I haven't even looked into it. You get a buck. Yep. Right out ahead of us. Pretty much right behind you and in front of me. He's tracking me down. I hope this cat didn't get unspooked because I made the mistake of calling to it and then crawling towards it. <laughs> Oh, Not gotta... just crawling towards it. I'm crawling through grass. I can't see nothing. You just gotta pop up when you think you might be close to it and take a chance. Mm -hmm. That's all you can do. Definitely can't see anything. Yeah, you forget what it's like when you have max graphics on. It covers up the whole animal pretty much. Yeah. And I still see it. 49 meters. Well, apparently I can kill it at that range with the 357 because I got the one at 43. Yeah, take it. 
spotting this pig out here. 890 to 990, but I'd rather the cat. If I could see it. What's this track here? Doe. What, is there two does coming in? I thought I heard a buck. Yeah, that's <laughs> why. It's a tiny buck. It's a little difficult to do a two-person drive. Yeah, that doesn't usually work as good. Where did my cat go? Where did my buck go? <laughs> I think you went behind the rock. It's straight up gone. Oh. I don't think it's spooked, but... I have eyes on this doe. Nice. Oh, there it is. Ooh, oh, he's shaking like crazy. Where's the buck? Oh, let him too much. Whoops. And he's gone. <sighs> to be continued. Did you get your cat? I see it. Oh, come on, take a few more steps. Got him. Nice. That's the second time he spotted me from a good distance, so he might actually be decent. Watch, the score's like 9.3. Hey, I wouldn't complain. Actually does look kind of decent size. Nope, definitely not. Eight flat. <laughs> Somehow I hit all three neck bone on it, though. All right, Bloodhound, have a good night. And that means Flinter, too. What? Oh, oh yeah, yeah. He said dudes. Gotcha. I thought you were telling me good night. I was like, oh, wait, are we stopping? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Speaking of stopping, what's your... Uh... Definitely hit the Thoughts. wrong button. <laughs> Hate when I do it. Trying to What's kill the auto mean? walk. Ah. Tabbed out on accident. What was that? What's your thoughts on how much longer you want to keep the stream going? Uh, we'll just swing around this corner up here and see what happens. Okay. I was hoping to end on a decent one, but yeah, it looks like this 90 to 100 scoring buck is going to be the decent one. Oh, you see him? Well, I jumped him up before. I don't see him right now. Ah. No sign of them. Huh. Smart buck. We've both got Call of the Wild on PC, Austin. There he goes. He busted up ahead of us. Where are you at? Actually, that might have been a doe. Oh. I'm off to your left. Okay. Nope. Got him hit. Nice. He's down. 
Sweet. Oh, I see he ran back at you. Yeah, he did. I did the clip art on him. That's kind of a decent way to end then. Yeah, that was a really solid ending. I think I hit him a couple times. Yeah, we got skull and then spine 69.3. <laughs> Perfect number to end on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, for sure. Alright, so... Yeah, well, thank you so much, Flinner, for joining in the, on the stream. Yeah, thanks for having me. And I think that's going to be the end of this video, so we'll see you guys next time.